I gotta put the thread ripper into the ripping mood. You ever watch that show, The Ripping Friends? Or is that like a Canada thing? That sounds like a Canada thing, you Canada <laughs> man. Canada man, Canada man, does whatever Canada can. Oh, that sounds... Makes a poutine any size. <laughs> you Sorry. Are, you, you are every size of poutine, baby. <laughs> I'm, listen, poutine is one size fits all. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back. Uh, we really weren't discussing anything of merit, but hey, we're live, getting ready for another Linux Gamecast Weekly. Uh, if you use Linux, that's cool. Maybe you like playing video games, and that's kind of what we talk about. If you're new to Linux, buckle up. <laughs> you're you're going to get lost. Hey, man, maybe, some, maybe they want a challenge. Is that it? <laughs> also, no. we're not sorry. <laughs> people, people don't install Linux for a challenge. People install Linux so that they have something to complain about on forums. <laughs> you mean Reddit? <laughs> Hi, Gary. <laughs> I mean, Reddit's basically a forum. That's all Reddit. It. No, man. I'm 14, and I think Reddit's underground. <laughs> uh, I, man, when your underground forum gets brought up on CNN, you might not be as underground as you think you are. Underground, bro. With all scared. the bull people. Old people, real people. Flat Moon, Rhombus Mars. <laughs> I really want to make. I a still prefer the um, Earth is a um, soup bowl theory. <laughs> Dude, I, I really want to make. That's why the water the doesn't go anywhere. <laughs> Flat Moon T-shirt, but I'm terrified if I do, I'd wear it out in public. Somebody oh would no! Come up, oh. You, yeah, you 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 get the flat earthers show oh. going up. Yeah. I don't know what to do with that. How's everybody doing? It is Saturday night, and, well, you're watching this, so... It's all right for fighting. <laughs> it is all right. Do you ever fight on Saturday night? I don't fight on Saturdays. Oh, oh, I, I finally got around to watching uh, Kingsman. The first one? The second one. Ah, uh, it's all right. It's serviceable. Yeah. It's, yeah. Mm, more of the same. I... I mean... That, that's the, that's kind of the that's that that's the trouble with sequels, right? You can either basically just make more of the first movie, or you can try to amp it up, and like try to do something different. But then people freak out; they're like, "I wanted the same thing," and then when you make the same thing, they're like, "I wanted something different." You can't you can't impress an audience; they don't know what they want. <laughs> we did get Halle Berry, though. We we did. And they said they're going to be doing a spinoff of the American. Team. Okay. Yeah. I, I I think I remember hearing something like the next movie is a prequel. It's gonna be like the it takes place in World War One, the King's Man. Oh right. Wait. I, we saw like a preview trailer of that. Yeah. Some something like that. Yeah. So I think that's the that's the next one. And then they said there's gonna be like one more that takes place like modern day. Mm. So I guess four of them. Good quadrilogy. Doesn't matter. Yeah. Overclock the Ryzen 3000. Yeah, Steve was doing that when I got back to the house. And how far did they get? How, how far can you push that? Like four or five? Uh, I don't know. It depends on what you're using for cooling. Um, LN2. They were going, yeah, they were going for five gigahertz. Use some uh, liquid helium. See how how yeah. hard we get it. Man, Pedro, are you overclocked? Don't need to, to be honest, because even with the, I'm not even following like the latest BIOSes, and it boosts to four point four. So, I'm good. That's what the 3700X can do, so <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> Not even tempted. How I'd like you? to get more on the RAM just to make sure I'm actually using the 3600s. But what? not on the processor now. What's the official supported speed for the um, Ryzen 9s? Uh, uh, 4.6. Really? Yeah. Huh. Which uh, they were saying is like, yeah, we 
we're not really getting that, uh, but uh, apparently with the new Ajisa version, the ABBA, mm -hmm. ABBA, <laughs> it, um, apparently it gets there on a single core, but it gets there. Well, it took like six to eight months with the uh, Ryzen 7 before I was able to hit three. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's like 29.33 for a, a chunk. And we felt like I got up to three, then I got to 3100 and left it alone. Oh, uh, yeah. are you talking about the RAM speeds? No, I'm talking about the front side bus. Yes, I'm talking about the <laughs> Okay, RAM yeah, speed talking with, about the, the, um, with the 3900X is uh, 4.2. I think it's the maximum. It's officially supported one. I'm not talking about supported. I'm talking about what, what does AMD because what was like 2133 for Ryzen 7? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, uh, the one they recommend is 3600. Ramstein. <laughs> There's probably a good video to be made about that. We need to do a Ramstein music video. Mm, I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying to think what song would be best for. Hmm. Set and sucked. <laughs> I go to hell, Turbo Brad. Uh, Turbo Brad's back. Yeah, yes. Turbo Brad came back. And, um. Damn it. <laughs> right. Why, why, why did it even bother coming back if it's fucking useless? So we could have this bit of comedy between us. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that, nope, nope, <laughs> nope. I kind of want to see Julia Roberts unhinge her jaw and like try to swallow someone whole. Don't, don't tempt it, man. <laughs> Next time Charles on Ocean's Nelson Eleven. Man, right. Ocean's Eleven foot gaping maw. Oh God, <laughs> Julia Roberts, no. That makes my jowls hurt, man. <laughs> How about this? Nope. Nope. <laughs> Even with two M's, not having any of that. <laughs> Mr. Fancy Pants. <laughs> Spelling things How right. How Imger? Rammstein. Then you're just gonna piss the bot off. It's just waiting. <laughs> what the... <laughs> Alright. Huh. Oh, it's a How gallery. <laughs> um... You ever listen to Lizzie Borden? No. I'm going to get a refill because we got two minutes before we go. All right. I'm going to quickly brush my teeth. Pedro, entertain <laughs> the people while getting tanked. Yeah. <laughs> Linux Nero, it's totally okay for you to be using an ad blocker. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> yeah, I don't think Turbo Brad is working all that well. Um, you can do that too, Linux Naru. You just need to, um, root it first. Or if you're just doing it over Wi Fi, you can do it without root. Just saying. <laughs> Just Twitch, yes. It's a bit of an experiment this evening. Mostly because YouTube, especially when it comes to games, it, it does not um, like whatever we're feeding it. And it makes everything look a bit... Well, it makes everything look a bit like ass, to be honest. <laughs> So yeah, if this experiment goes well... <laughs> yes. <laughs> you look at us and you look at a picture of uh, Atomic, it's like... Huh. <laughs> but yeah, no, especially if you go back and look at some of the VODs uh, that we did with, like, games. Put 
Twitch and YouTube side by side, and Twitch, it's crisp. You can see exactly what's going on. You go on YouTube, it's like, oh, that that's a scary mess. <laughs> What are we experimenting on? <laughs> Twitch only this evening. Oh, sure. Be like that. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know. I just felt like putting you in an indefensible position, man. Come on. Night's early. Defend from what? <laughs> Double dare you. <laughs> Man, we got a lot to cover tonight, everyone. Hopefully we'll be semi-efficient in doing it. Hopefully I won't cock everything up. It's, it's going to be a fun one. <laughs> my scroll wheel's on my thumb. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Input methods... Yeah. <laughs> it's all wrong. It's all bad. It's... <laughs> Should have used Mixer. Yeah, we're going to need some of that Microsoft money before we get to Mixer. <laughs> That's the only way to drink tequila. I thought the only way to drink tequila was out of someone's navel. No. <laughs> I'm afraid of ships. <laughs> All right. I guess we can get rocky and roll. We can do this at a regular time. Yeah. I tend to, to just like drag Scott in here. I'm like, oh, fine. Scott! <laughs> Scott! Only drinking to kill it when the rum is gone. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know what, Foxy? I mean, okay. <laughs> 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 it's like when will I when will I finally stop cooking baking in the nude? And it's like that'll take care of itself, dude. Don't worry. <laughs> I had a uh, very very dark burn mark on my belly because it Aww. tilted and it spilled on me. <laughs> I'll I'll usually start cooking naked for the first bit. I'm like then eventually once the oil starts getting hot enough, I'll be like, all right, time to put a shirt on. <laughs> you wait for the first uh, tracer to come at you yeah and, and then I'm like alright right. yep <laughs> cause, cause you know putting on clothes takes effort and if I can avoid exerting that effort I, I will life hack <laughs> yeah <laughs> life hack it just got burns all over your chest you think it's brilliant yeah just my, <laughs> my, my, my stomach looks like the phantom of the opera's face <laughs> Take a look at this, Christine! Oh god! Go on a jog or something, Jesus Christ! Right. Put a shirt on! Oh man, I, t I totally want to do that now, like, a Phantom of the Opera remake where, like, the Phantom is just, like, this fat dude. <laughs> that could work. Yeah. Alright. Get ready to do it. Is it? Is that Jim Carrey? Yeah, no, I had to put a shirt no. on for this show and it's still warm, so it's like. <laughs> you, you need to deworm your shirt. I'll do the shirt. <laughs> or I'll, I'll do warm. the shirt show us. Why not? <laughs> you know, I haven't eaten, so I could probably not, like. I could, I, I, I could power it. Power through it. <laughs> Listen, listen, man. I, I, I know you're troubled by my sexy, sexy shoulders. Just, just but... Don't, don't get the baby oil out. Promise me that. It's too late. <laughs> too late. Here's, here's the secret, Bruce. I'm <laughs> always covered in baby oil. Mm, just squeeze the shirt. 
<laughs> not so macho man. I want to be a macho. All right, let's fucking do it. All right, are we warmed up now? Fine. <laughs> uh, let's see. Theater is locked. One, one, two, three, shut. Ah, uh, gotta give that a refresh. Look at that. <laughs> Yes, it is, Scott. Yes, it is. <laughs> what? Nope. Aha. There we go. All right. Groovy. Showtime. Yeah. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, let's do this night now. Three, two, and welcome back to another Linux Gamecast Weekly, the show that covers the latest Linux gaming news, reviews, how-tos, and most importantly, whatever the hell else we come up with. This week, Valve adds some epic terms to their distribution agreement. Hopefully, it's going to put a stop to the last-minute exclusives and well, classic nurse Linux players, but for all the right reasons. Steam VR gets some Linux performance updates. Man, it must be nice for Valve to help have all three backs of the Linux using index owners. And Litris has a new version and a new icon. Both need more human teeth. Blasphemous says it's still coming to Linux. Yet another Kickstarter game that delayed its Linux release and deploying your own emulator cloud for fun and profit right up until Nintendo catches wind of it. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm old man Vince Stone, joined every week by the man up north, where it's uh, starting to get cold again. He'll finally be able to uh, put on his Eskimo shoes and all that other fun <laughs> stuff and slip and fall. It'll be brilliant. My, 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 it's my Eskimo friend. tassels. And that I, uh, lovely man down there with the for w weirdo. What, why do you hang stuff on doorknobs? That's Pedro Mateus. <laughs> joining because us. Because the camera was focusing Stand on the doorknob. Up late That's in why. Britannia with you live. <laughs> Shot room dynamic helping us form Go Game Voltron. Before we get started, we do like to see what's going on in each other's life organs. Gentlemen, has it been a fun week? Anything exciting? Anything new? Anything moderately sexy and or terrifying possibly covered in latex? Well, like, like I was saying earlier, I got caught up on Preacher, and now I, I regret doing that because now I'm, I, it does those cliffhangers on, uh, on, on this last season. Dude, wouldn't you yeah. agree that me and Pedro, we're hooked. We're like, we're just out yet. We got to watch it. And yeah. <laughs> the, we know this is the last series being mm -hmm. the fourth. That writer room's like, F it, man. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> it, it, it's ramping up. It's, it got really good real quick. Like, mm, damn. Yep. <laughs> I'm down with that. Anything new with you, um, Pedro? Well, uh, the um, El Cheapo Project PC has a case, it has a power supply, and the motherboard and the processor and everything else is in it, okay. except for the GPU. All right, did did you pull the trigger on the AliExpress YOLO? No, oh. no, I, I, I won the 75-pound uh, bid on an Asus Trix RX 570. So it supposedly comes on Monday or Tuesday, so I'll be waiting for that. It's looking forward to you, like, getting like, a new hamster or something. <laughs> like, oh, well. Uh, <laughs> oh, I was reading the thing that you posted in Discord, and it was, like, 100 tested. I'm like, what? Yeah. <laughs> Question mark, percent, smiley face. I don't know, man. It was kind of brilliant. Over here. Uh, dude. I got this thing. Ooh. It's probably not a sex toy. But then again, I'm not brave enough, so I'll never find out. It, it, it comes from Japan, so it's probably a sex toy. Yeah, legit, dude. There's not outside. Someone post pointed it out, and he's like, "Well, it says Alicom right here," and that, and it says huge. It's huge in Japan. Much huge. Like <laughs> it's big, man. First time ever bought a uh, trackball, and I, I'm learning how to use this monstrous little thing. But it hopefully will help out with editing. And it's legitimately, if I had one gripe. My hand fits on it, which is weird. I'm not accustomed to that. I'm mm -hmm. accustomed to having to do that to use a mouse. M uh, the thumb button's kind of weird, but then again, scroll wheels on the side and all that. But I'm happy with it. It's, it's not too bad. So that's what's up with me. I do want to mention before we get into it, this week uh, we're giving away a copy of Speedrunners, which we played last Ooh. night, which was fun. Jordan it's even brought up his speed chalk. 
live. <laughs> that's, that's, that's not a euphemism for cocaine. Nope. It's actual chalk. Actual chalk. <laughs> Suck it. Um, so uh, if you want to fish out the three parts of the key that will be in here, there's your first one. Uh, it's going to be in post for watching live. Wah, wah, but thanks. We love you. Anyway, much like the horse. <laughs> The horse doesn't love anyone or anything. It's completely incapable of emotions other than hate. It's the steam! Linux! Update! Of the week. It's also going through a bit of a court scenario because there seems to be a lot of uh, discovery happening. Yeah. Well, uh, they, there's a brand new update for that. Uh, Valve pushed out a uh, minor uh, search algorithm update to about 5% of their users over the past few months. And apparently it was deemed successful enough to get released to Gen Pop. And so, in the coming weeks, you're going to start seeing a few more obscure games in your recommendations. Um, this is this is their automated... Obscure yeah. or shit that I might actually want to play? <laughs> a little column A, little column B. Fair enough. That, that, that's, that's kind of like the big gripe that indie devs are having with Steam, is that their niche titles are being hidden away from the people who would uh, ostensibly want to play them. So, this is supposed to help... Um, you uh, identify similar games to things that you already play and recommend them to you. Uh, and hopefully this will stop the leaking of exclusivity. But we'll get we'll get to that in a little bit. Has anyone has anyone uh, anyone got hit with this? Anyone seeing some new uh, new additions to the Steam Store that you're? Uh, oh, what what what'd you get? Fucking all, man. Because I don't. <laughs> I, I've Valve, you've taught me not to rely on your services. If I find out about a game, it's the last place it's ever been would uh, Steam. It's usually Twitter, yeah. yeah. However, <laughs> I do look forward to seeing how uh, this will end up getting abused, because it will end up getting abused, Pedro. It's on Steam, and it's something that they've implemented not to do it manually, so yeah, it will get abused. <laughs> but uh, games, you know, uh, the, the big shift here is like, yeah, it used to be that really popular games were getting recommended to people, and that was making those uh, less uh, popular ones, but still pretty good games, uh, were being buried. But, okay, what about the developers and the publishers of those really popular games? Mm. Because I don't think they're going to be too happy. It's like, oh yeah, we're doing pretty good, because our game kept showing up, and people kept buying it, and now it doesn't. Well, they've done a bunch of different things. We A couple of weeks back, we talked about the change. It was like, you can't every two weeks change the release date of your game to get that page bomb. Yeah. So, <laughs> I don't know, man. Um, it's, hey. it's like it's it's like any machine learning solution. You gotta wait and see if it'll actually do what it says it does. I, I don't know if... Steam's machine learning counts to potato or eats to potato, but it's one or the other. <laughs> I, th I think it's just the horse. Dude, check this out. Uh, Valve has added a new stipulation to the distribution agreement that could, actually, I think it will affect the exclusives going to other stores. <laughs> and by that, you know the fuck we're talking about, right? And we are talking about, uh, it basically says, hey, man, if you're going to submit, can I even zoom in on this? Let's try. Come on, Matt Hacks. Enhance! Enhance! So, uh, okay, within 30 days of the effective date, thereafter, company shall submit to Steam any localized versions application, but in no event later than they are provided to any other third-party commercial release. Company shall provide these copies in object code form in whatever format Valve reasonably requests, usually weasels, but what this says at the end of the day, this boils down to you can't use Steam to plug your shit anymore. You can't do the free ads and like, oh, wait, it's two weeks to release uh, Epic Exclusive. And <laughs> I know Sweeney's like, but man, I was I was sorting by new release. And that's how we were picking, right? And mm -hmm. we were making, you know, making it rain. The only thing I could see Epic doing now... This would require all the infinite popcorn. What if they're like, yeah, do it anyway. We'll pay the legal fees. Man, let's test this out. <laughs> I kind I kind of want to see Sweeney pull that. Like, mm. yeah, let's, let, let, let's see if Valve's but... uh, willing to put their money where their mouth is. Because th those yeah, sorts of suits, it, like, drag. It would be Valve epic gears. going against Valve and court. <laughs> But yeah, it's uh, right now it's just a matter of seeing which game developer slash publisher is going to run afoul of this particular um, clause in the distribution yeah, I, agreement. So 
I'm I'm cur I'm curious how harshly Valve will go after them just to like try and make an example of the first person to try and pull something yeah. like this. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if anybody really wants to test that. What, is it, I, what I want to know is that this couldn't be retroactive. I think it's fair I, game for anybody that. True, true, but um, I I, I think this this will be enough, right? Yeah, the, this will at least dissuade a lot of them, right? So, and 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 I and I think in at least in this case, they're gonna like if you if you have a Valve developer account, they're gonna force this on you like the next time you log in. So you have to agree to it mm. if you want to like yeah. continue to use oh, yeah. the Steam platform. All right. So. so so it won't be retroactive, but it will be applied to existing stuff on the store by virtue of people using the service. I think it's pretty much guaranteed. This is not the last we've heard of this. Oh no, no. Oh um, no. I got, I got some oh, popcorn no. in the microwave ready to go. <laughs> Everspace. <laughs> yes. So, uh speaking of uh Steam trying to do things to get away from Epic, well, uh the Everspace devs uh did get an offer from the Sweeney to mm -hmm. go exclusive on the Epic Store, but they decided to turn it down. And their reasoning was basically, yeah, people would be pissed at us if we did that. And we had a pretty good run with um, our uh, first game, Everspace, which was, uh, for them anyway, it had Valve or Steam as a platform, gave them everything that they needed to get the game out there and get it into the hands of people. And uh, they were big fans of the early access model because that's where they got a lot of the money from the first Everspace sales. So, yeah. yeah it, tur it turns out, Pedro, that if you provide a lot of tools to interface with a community and solicit feedback and test things, that mm -hmm. developers might, you know, be receptive to that, as opposed to the, the Sweeney approach, which is basically just, here's a lot of cash, do with it what you will. Yeah, and you kind of lose out, you know, the, the whole epic thing is you get guaranteed money, and mm -hmm. by not taking it, you kind of lose out on that. But at the same time, Epic is only offering uh, that particular exclusivity deal to those games that they feel will already make that kind of money on their own. Well, so this way you get to keep, you know, the goodwill of the people who bought the previous one and you get to keep using Valve's rather significant infrastructure. That's definitely a thing. <laughs> Do you think there's anything to be said for? Because we had a developer a couple of weeks back that turned down they're like i don't want to go exclusive on epic dark they, yeah yeah and they're like, mm -hmm. okay but we'd like to be on the store and they're like no nah. yeah like, wow okay yeah <laughs> but it, it 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 really does show what the priorities of the epic store really are they're trying they're trying to establish as much lock-in as possible yeah they're basically basically muscling in instead of competing they're m trying to muscle valve yeah, out yeah, of the monopoly we, we've been over that a billion times do you think it's safe to say that exclusivity in a game is really not necessary unless your game's shit. Because if your game's good, it's going to sell. Possibly. I, I would say that exclusivity makes more sense in like a console model, right? Because mm. then it's tied to an actual bit of hardware. In terms of yeah. like PC gaming, you don't, you don't even need to have the operating system that it was intended to run on in order to run games. So... Yeah. <laughs> but that that's the thing. It's... Um... Exclusives as they currently stand serve no purpose other than for Epic to try and become the de facto monopoly. They want to get they want to absolutely crush Steam, so crush. Crush. Right. Um Steam VR's thing. It is, it is. and you know, so, some some people, well, three people actually use it. Oh God, that Mr. Meeseeks body horror thing, man. That's is that that's what some, that is? I thought that was. Just I, I I have no idea, but that's some that's some disturbing Lovecraftian nonsense. Anyway, Steam VR one point seven. Uh, they have a new update one point seven dot fifteen. Um, and because all of this is not particularly relevant to us, we do the old Control F Linux, and lo and behold, <laughs> improved Linux performance under the Linux section. Um, there's a lot of like reducing CPU usage, fixing system hangs. I'm curious though, how much of this is actually targeted uh, directly at uh, Steam VR via Proton as opposed to Steam VR native? Because there's not really any games under Linux that are used aside from like Serious Sam and Dota mm -hmm. that have like a native Linux VR. Well, no, that's hundred percent, man. I, I think that's also um, 
if they're going to keep rolling out with Vive, that's the support we're seeing. We're seeing fixes for Proton to work with SteamVR. And yep. hey, man, all six of those people, ecstatic. Yeah. <laughs> the, 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 there was one interesting thing I saw for uh, the Oculus support where there's some weird path issue where like, using the latest version of like the oculus driver you need to change the path and then change it back after the application has launched so they have they have some interesting fixes for that um, but you're ready for that i mean if you're doing vr through steam on linux man with an oculus that's a kickwalk. Yeah. you're like i got this <laughs> I, I, you, you know what you're in for you know what you're in for but on the proton front man yeah, there's a there's a brand new version, Proton 411.4. Very, very minor. It has a new version of DXVK. It's got a new version of D9VK, new version of F Audio. Um apparently uh if you're if you're like Pedro and you insist on not attaching a cable to your Bluetooth or not your Bluetooth, your uh, PlayStation Port Bluetooth. controller. <laughs> yeah, uh you, you will be able to actually use this while playing games. <laughs> and Farming Simulator fans rejoice. You can now play Farming Simulator 2019 on under under Proton. Woo! Man, I I have been holding out, man. I've been running Windows all this time. But you know, I love it. Please, Flying Spaghetti Monster, let that out. I'm going to search that after the show. I'm, like, <laughs> yeah, but I'm waiting on Farming Simulator 2019 when that drops on Linux. And boom. Boom. It just came out, though, didn't it? And I don't know. And, 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 and the, the wait was worthwhile. <laughs> Excellent work. I'm glad they, they were really staying up to date because, you know, up until very recently, you know, DX, especially DXVK was dragging behind a few releases. And, mm -hmm. uh, more I, than I, I think there may have been a little bit of QC there. Yeah, definitely good to see. Yeah. And still no goddamn Batman. So, <laughs> all right. And finally, don't starve. We we got some, we got some game updates we got to talk about. Don't mm -hmm. starve. Uh, the they've updated Woody the lumberjack character. I played him the time that Foxy Jill and I were playing Don't Starve, and Foxy was playing him last time. Basically, he's a guy who wears a lot of plaid and hungers for wood, and then turns into a furry monster if he doesn't get fed. But now, now they, they've changed it. Now, now he's no longer a beaver who hungers for wood. Um, <laughs> he can turn into a were moose now if you eat what? monster lasagna. That is the most Canadian thing, man. A were moose. I know. Like, <laughs> a I, 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 I just feel I feel the poutine inside me right now, and it feels good. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, they they have two new transformations for the uh, lumberjack. Um, I'm on team tree. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, they got they got Sailor Moon accessories uh, for streaming drops, and uh, yeah, just a couple bug fixes uh, in regards to this character update. Um, so I mean, we we might we might try it out on Thursday just to see how uh, how lumbersexuals really fare in the world that don't starve. Dude, I every time I've tried to play that game, here's my experience playing the game. Oh look, I'm ghost now. All right, where are you guys at? I'll just follow you around and be yeah. non-corporeal and shit. Foxy and I were doing okay the last run. I think we're we're, I had we're, we're slowly I getting better. I was here working with something. And I was like, "Wait, you guys are still playing?" All right, and then just join this, and boom, go back and yep. watch that vod instantly. Yeah, dead. it's like, oh, hey, Ven joined. Hey, Ven yeah. died. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Too real, man. Too real. Okay, it's, it's, yeah. com well, it's coming. Though. Something that unfortunately isn't real, uh, and they totally promised is on their Kickstarter is blasphemous on Linux. And if you're like me and you saw like the like the first trailer that they presented for Blasphemous and you've been going, oh, yeah, I want to play that. Well, uh, you're going to have to wait. They do say that the uh, Linux and Mac versions uh, will be coming really soon. But uh, if you are using Steam on Mac, you can already uh, request the build. So I'm guessing you don't even have it on steam yet they you just request the build and they send it to you but yeah on linux we're going to have to wait for whatever really soon means mm. but again it's another kickstarter game that promised linux and then release came around it's like eh, we'll get to that this is the kind of shit that keeps driving people away from kickstarting games developers oh oh sweetheart yeah that ship <laughs> sailed i i think everyone is <laughs> fully aware now that you're, you're placing a bet yeah yeah <laughs> it's, it's it's like real estate speculation yeah so. and this one i really want to play it because yeah the art looks amazing and it's it looks like castlevania 
with the grit turned up to a thousand. So and more nipple yeah. Clamps. <laughs> I think it could be done with it. I mean, if they've already got like something working on Mac, what is this thing running? Unity, probably. Yeah, the, the, that's I what I was going to ask. Is what 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 is this actually built on? Um, we we, 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 don't, we don't know. Maybe, maybe some maybe someone with a Mac uh, download the Mac version and tell <laughs> yeah. us. Look, right. look, look in the game data. Justin Mir, uh, one of you to uh, have a look at that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, Justin, you have like literally eighty thousand Macs. Check there it you out. Go. <laughs> hey. Uh, Hot new application sweeping the nation, Krita. It's a great game. It's kind of fun if you're into Digital Painting Simulator 2019 edition. But I wanted to give this a mention because I'm like, what the holy what? Um, it is, you know, a really, really decent free open source uh, paint tool that is so far beyond me. I'm like, look at the pretty shit you can make with this. I'm not smart enough. But, yeah, you, you need a tablet. <laughs> yeah, kind of like that. It's fancy. It's nine ninety nine. Now, again, you can go download this, and you know, it's single player, no multiplayer, unfortunately. But that's just supporting them. Like, hey, if you want to support this, you can get this. And we've said for a long time it'd be great for. Let's see what the requirements are. Uh, nothing. As much system video <laughs> memory as possible for large. All right, everything's cool. I got, I I got you, fam. I got 10 gigs. All right. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but for software, I mean, Steam's a really good way to keep things up to date. Indeed. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes you forget that you can actually buy software off Steam that's not games. On Linux, I mean, what do we have? We have like three apps or something like that. I Game really Engine. do. I really do wish for open source stuff, though, that um, Steam would offer like a pay what you want option. Mm hmm. Well, what I would that, like that, to see is like if you have an established open source project that you don't have to pay the hundred dollar. Yeah, yeah. You, you you just get on yeah. because right, yeah. that, that'd go a long way. But but you yeah. know nine ninety nine or uh, six pounds ninety nine over here, it's a very nice price. Uh, it is especially for something is. as you know fully featured as Krita, and I I can see how that might some bullshit artists might look at that price and say, oh, it's probably crap, and they, they won't even try it, but for it, something it's, this good, it's cheaper that's than very Photoshop. Nice price. Here's the if thing. You, if you yeah. don't feel like going to the Pirate Bay, it's cheaper than Photoshop. Here's the thing. nine ninety nine is worth it if you use it just for the ease of updates. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Done. And, or you can wait for packaged on whatever distribution, or you can build it yourself. Yeah, yeah. Bucks, or or, or, or you could or you could fuck with your boss and it works like why do you need steam installed on your on this work computer Reasons. oh i use it to update krita yeah no, right. I'm, I'm not, I'm, <laughs> yeah krita. I'm, I'm, I'm not playing fdl at work no no not at all <laughs> okay we do have one other an actual new game and it looks yes pretty decent it does uh it is still in early access though that's like the one thing i can uh point at it and say mm. But it is Age of Grit, and they uh, describe it as explore a Wild West-inspired world in a steampunk air sh uh, airship. Like, huh. So it is basically like FTL style of combat, but instead of spaceships, they're just airships in the Wild West. Jordan, and the rest you're of the thinking, game, where's the giant spider? Yeah, I, I'm yeah. guessing that's you know, going to be you one know, of the bosses. There, 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 probab probably. there probably is a giant spider in here. <laughs> I, I, they would be they would be remiss if they're going to make a steampunk Wild West game and not include a giant yeah, spider. Yeah, but it, that, that spider yeah. better be busy fighting Superman. Or a, or a polar bear. <laughs> they're the deadliest yes. predators in the animal kingdom. This you know work. that. But yeah, it is uh, very much a CRPG. Like the, the rest uh, outside of combat, it is very much in the style of might and magic. So... Yeah, if this is your bag and you don't mind paying the early access price, you should give it a look because it does look very interesting. Hmm. I'll wait it, until, it does, it's, uh, it, until it's done. <laughs> it does look very good, but 20 bucks for early access is still a little, yeah. Yeah. It's still a little steep. Well, compared to that ship game, that's like $30. Right, yeah. Right. That, 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 that's the biggest scoff. Although, like, if this is your jam, mm -hmm. probably paying 20 bucks for this is not that big a deal. Well, yeah, I mean, think of how much time you've lost to FTL-type games. Like, e exactly, like, <laughs> I'll, 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 I'd probably end up getting my money's worth. I still gotta do, make some more progress in Deep Sky Derelicts, though. Mm. Stay, stay tuned next Thursday. You know, we be doing yeah. that. <laughs> Alright, coming up next, we lost Pennywise to it, but then it kicked him out. Now he's back. On Linux. From the dead bitches. Or at least from Azeroth.
What are you drinking, Pedro? Beer. Okay. It, lo it, it looks like it, the bottle kind of looks like a, like a fancy like whiskey or whatever. Yeah. So Abbott I have a, both. <laughs> Abbott Ale. Yep. 5%. It's nothing spectacular, but it tastes all right. So, yeah. <laughs> I do have a bottle of that 7.7, because that was nice. <laughs> and uh, Tesco's are doing a thing, it's like you buy any four bottles of these half liter ones, uh, and it's six pounds. So it's like, okay, let's pick the ones that have the highest alcohol concentration. There we go. <laughs> no, Nori, I'm not alcoholic. I'm value oriented. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not an alcoholic. I'm just cheap. I I drink one day a week now, so... <laughs> Let's see... Oh, you're drinking water, gotcha. <laughs> Dry, zero... The, what is the point of that, the existence of that in your hand? That's a can of water, that's what that is. <laughs> Truly? Truly berry? Yeah, yeah, that, that's that's the carbonated Vodak, right? I... Uh, I don't know, man. This is alcohol what? technology I'm unfamiliar with. I don't, when, I, when I hear Herd alcohol? Seltzer, that's like, yeah, just <laughs> CO2 with Vodak. That's very diluted vodka. <laughs> five, oh, it's only 5% Vodak. Yeah. <laughs> so that's just vodka flavored. Oh, I can tell that this is mildly alcoholic. Okay. <laughs> well, this is one of the things I definitely don't get because I see that in the grocery all the time, especially in the summer, they have the pre-mixed margaritas. <laughs> but it's in the grocery. It's not in the liquor store. I'm like, that does not contain the appropriate amount of alcohol. No, because you, you, you need to go buy the tequila separately and assemble it yourself. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's just sugar with alcohol flavor. I get it. Maddie, someone didn't watch the show. No. <laughs> no, Maddie came in like halfway through. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's been staring at the YouTube page. Like, <laughs> why haven't they gone live yet? I told you we would get at least one person. <laughs> we might have a winner. Ding, ding, ding. You want a copy of Tyranny? Maddie, that's what you win. <laughs> I, got, I got an extra one from the Humble Bundle. Grocer Drive. Or actually, um, Pillars of Eternity. I'd probably I'd probably give a recommendation to Pillars over Tyranny. But... Um, PSA for everyone, if you don't have Dirt Rally, it is currently free on Steam. Right meow. Derp Rally? Yes. Meow. Get yourself some of that. Kudos, Mir. <laughs> you now realize. What? That can of water that he had. That, that's all he's, he's been drinking he's... this entire month. What do you mean? <laughs> he's saying that that's horrible, so. Yeah, that yeah. also causes amnesia. <laughs> don't, don't, don't ruin it for him. <laughs> What would you do if, would you trust that? Would you get anything oh, done if no. we could like selectively remove memories? Like, hey man, uh, you could like go in like, like eternal uh, sunshine style. We're talking like precision. It's like, I've never seen breaking bad. Oh, like completely wipe all of that from your memory, huh? Yeah. You, you, you have to memento, you know, in the paperwork and everything. You're like, oh, what mm -hmm. shows this is, this is how it would start by the way. If you're going to commercialize this, make it innocent enough. Before, um, yeah, and be like, oh, what shows would you like? Battlestar but Galactica. Yeah, let's rewatch that. And <laughs> you have little notes. You're like, these things are awesome. And you know that you've had the thing done, but you just don't read. You're like, oh, all right. You get I that feeling of it's like, I've seen this before, but okay. <laughs> the, 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 this puts my brain into like limited wish mode from Dungeons and Dragons because it's like, well, what does that actually mean? Because if I remove Breaking Bad from my brain, then everything I've done as a result of me seeing Breaking Bad just becomes like this weird contextless, like, why did I do this again? You know, why did I make it? Why do I have a drawer full of meth in my room? 
Hey, look on the bright <laughs> side. You sh- we won't get those visits from Danny Trejo anymore, man. I like, I like it when Danny shows up, though. You, you say that we, now. We, we play say, Golden Axe. It's like Stockholm Syndrome at this point. <laughs> Listen, man, Dan- Danny's my bae. Danny is best girl. Right. Oh, man, Any I started I started watching right. uh, Dark on Netflix, but that dub is terrible. What What's Dark? Uh, it's like a German time travel show. Somebody had mentioned that to me. Yeah, but like the, the English dub is really bad. And like, I can't. I'm, I'm fine with subtitles, but I dislike them in the sense that I can't... I have to focus on that, right? Well, okay. Here's the weird question. I won't need the subtitles, but do you get the feel that it's, like, acted good? I would need I would need to turn on the, the actual German track. Mm. Oh, you don't have the German audio on. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I was, I was just watching the English dub. Hmm. Just because, like, when I'm watching shit on Netflix, I'm not just, like, sitting down and watching on Netflix. I'm, like, cooking or cleaning or... Right. Yeah. I mean, even if I watched it in... I would have to focus and fucking pay attention to it. I couldn't, like, Right, like, yeah, if, 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 I, if I spoke enough German... It's the same thing, like, with watching anime. If I spoke enough Japanese to, like, more or less piece shit together, I think I'd be fine, but... Yeah. That was, um... Uh, one thing about this um, track durable, I was glad there was nothing I needed to read, dude. And I was like, wow, that's what it's like. All right. Mm. And I know some of you wonderful weebs out there and like, I import stuff from Japan all the time. I don't. So it's been a month and two days working in Japan. I'm, I'm good. Me and Japan are, we're full. I'd want to do, like, the only reason I really want to go to Japan is, like, the food tourism. See, I wouldn't, I think I would, wouldn't mind going on, like, a tourist run. Like, go hit Tokyo and, you know, and come other, you know, just. Yeah, like, I, I, I just, I just want to eat, like, a lot of good ramen and sushi. And, yeah. Yeah. Like, the, like, I'm, I might go to the, like, the, the Heisei Museum to, like, do goofy poses in front of the Kamen Rider statues. Just, um, like raid like old game shops and stuff. Yeah, just oh stuff yeah, like that. yeah, right. yeah, and, and just like see see what you can grab. Get right, oh, uh, or maybe maybe get like a sword or something. Food tour in Japan. There's a plan. Pedro, we're going to Japan next week. You coming? Uh, are you buying? Because if so, no. yes. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta hitch a ride. Right. <laughs> Go up to the airplane pirate pilot and be like, gas, grass, no, grass. No, air, airplane, airplane pirate. pirate. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm paying. I be stealing this right. plane for the name in the name of the Spanish queen. Yar. It's great. It's like, this is your captain. Yeah, this be your captain. Anyone who did not put their tray tables in the upright position can walk the plank. Just opens up the cabin and depressurizes it. <laughs> oh, man. Hmm. Right. Let's see. Um, really, let's just run it with um, Patreon and Wish Zone. All right, don't bring up the store. Oh, and store. Psst, see, thank you. Helpful marketing person. Yeah. I'm making out Patreon. I clicked, wait, did I click the right button? Yes, I did. Yay. Zone this, store. This, this, this fucking finger? This is a weird one for left click. Oh. I mean, <laughs> right click. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, the only reason I use this finger is to be like, I'm not flipping you off. Yeah, <sighs> pretty much, right? <laughs> I, I genuinely, I think like my this this finger is like one of the least used ones. I use my pinky more. Uh, this one's really good at getting broken and or jammed. Yes, yeah, it's that <laughs> finger, man. Yeah, I can't honestly think of anything that I use my. Oh, it holds the ring. Uh, 
It's got that going that. for it. It's it's honest. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's what it's there for. <laughs> I'm I'm just looking at all like the weird scarring I have on my hands. I don't oh yeah, my little soul sucking thing looks like it's kind of healed up almost. Good, start fucking with it. Yeah, can't see it anymore, but uh, yeah, the friction burn on my thumb. <laughs> I'd have to get up on the camera. This is, this is where I put a nail gun through this. <laughs> yeah. I, I have a, I have a nice row, like, row of calluses and like nice. torn calluses. If you're just tuning in, it doesn't get better, so just keep going. Yeah. <laughs> they call them fingers, but I never see them thing. Oh, there they go. <laughs> my hands are so big, they can touch anything but themselves. Oh, wait. It's not Jimmy the Spider who we clocked with a cue ball. We were at a pool ball. Dude, shut up. It's like, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm Jimmy the Spider. I can catch anything. Whew. Chris just launched. Dude. Didn't catch it. Then we played like 1942, the plane game. We I eventually am. got up and left. That's kind of like the that's kind of the risky bit about like having an arcade cabinet handy is like, oh shit, we got Galaga. Shit, all right. <laughs> I like the Sega Rally arcade machines, or 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 like Pac Man or some shit. Yeah, you just get bored and start playing Pac Man. Mostly because I knew the unlock code for the Stratus, so I basically had all the ice scores. <laughs> I cheated, so yeah. Um, <laughs> if you've ever seen this boy play Distance, you, you know what he's all about. <laughs> Everyone else is racing. Pedro's like, oh, here I go. He, he just disappears. I must go now. My people if it'll need save me. me like a whole minute of race time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, actually, actually, that'll be fun for the chair acquisition. Let's see what kind of bullshit Pedro gets up to when the stuff that he recorded. Oh. Mm. There's no shortcuts in that game. <laughs> did, did anyone put in their actual name? Because I was like A A B or I, I I tried, but then like I, I got I got J O and I missed R and I'm like wait is backspace and I just kept hitting S because I was like... looking for like friends scores and I was like I don't know these people I was like y'all motherfuckers did the same thing I did. Ah. I got mine. I don't remember. When, but I already had a profile when I started the game, and it had my name on it. So okay, <laughs> I think they sent us they sent us that a while ago when we talked yeah. about it back when I was in early access or some shit. Okay, well let's. It's rock okay, the taco clock. Clock is love. Clock is life. Oh. Tick tock. Right, Pedro, are you good? You didn't break anything. You didn't give birth, right? No. <laughs> That's what I imagine it sounds like when you give birth. Just you, though. <laughs> Same sound. <laughs> Don't ask. All right. Yeah, and no, three, I'm, you know, I'm, uh... two. Well, we are about to give birth to a whole segment worth of news, but before we get to that, we do need to uh, get into a little bit of a C-section with shilling ourselves. That was bad. That was, man. <laughs> that, 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 that was terrible. Go, go, 80% chance of vaginal rupture. Check out our Patreon, <laughs> patreon.com slash Linux Gamecast. It's the best way to support us because you can get cool stuff in return for your money, like access to our Discord channel or show notes, or you can see our VODs a few days early, or if we're playing games like on... Uh, people. Yeah, if if we're uh, playing games on mostly Friday and Thursday, uh, you can you can maybe come along and play some games with us. It's fun. Pedro doesn't like to play with other people though. Um, we you also get access to an extra Depends hour a games. week of content, the pre pre super shows, and where we bullshit and talk about hands. We do that just for you, man. We are completely community funded, so come join that community if you yeah. want. If you're like, yeah, you're stupid, help out somebody else. It's brilliant. We do appreciate it. And you get access to that. You get the live audio stream when we go live. If you just want to listen, mm -hmm. we make that available. And uh, the other six days of the week, we're in Discord. 
that's a yeah. weird place. It's a very friendly place, strangely enough, but it's still... It's, 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 it's a little bizarre. It is. But yeah, if, if, if you don't want to give us some recurring support, but maybe you want to buy us a bit of hardware to help us improve this mess. How about the, uh, we like got, a, uh, the t-shirt hardware? Yeah, the t-shirt hardware. Yes. Well, there's there's That's an Amazon wish going, list, right? but the but there's also the store. Yeah, if you want to clothe the, close your clothe yourself, close. cover your disgust, close close, close yourself off, close yes, yourself clothe off from yourself. the rest of the world because you're not going to be able to wear these shirts in public without getting some weird looks. But you can buy them if you want. They're available. Dude, store we got stickers too. You can cover yourself in clothes stickers. You absolutely. You can close yourself off. With oh stickers. yeah, put them over your nipples. <laughs> hey, I'm working on a new shirt. Uh, if you were in Discord earlier, you might might have saw that. I'm definitely making something like. I want something I want to wear out in public, so mm, that that'll yeah. be out next the, week. That functional LGC apparel, but yeah, we got an Amazon wish list. Uh, this this entire endeavor takes quite a bit of hardware and software to accomplish, and it can get a little expensive. So if you want to help us out, you can check out our wish list. That's available at LinuxGameCast.com. Just go to the support drop down. We have wish zones for everybody. Oh, you should you should buy a Venn a tablet mm. or a fan to. I guess that fan is <laughs> yes. to clip on the the mic stand that buy holds his camera. Fan. He needs it, another it, one. It blows, man. It one hundred percent does. Hey, we do want to thank every single person back here on Frank's Wall of Fine Upstanding Cannibals because they have helped us. They're like the game genie for this shit. We'd be way behind <laughs> in our capabilities if it weren't for you. So that's awesome. That is, and Frank appreciates it. He even flies by in the credits, which your name will be in. I know. We're going to tell people. For shame. Oh, yeah. Shame. <laughs> shame. So, ding, how ding. about them news? Ven, did you ever play WoW? <laughs> you know, fuck no, I didn't. Ever. <laughs> Came you, close. You, you, okay. You, you ever DDoS someone? Oh, hell yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I was a boy once, too, Jordan. I know it might be... I, I can install lower bit ion cannon. That's a thing. <laughs> Oh, no, Windows used to have a flaw. You could do it over the local network and just yeah. nuke people, man. Uh, check this out. So when it comes to WoW, just that quick story, uh, when did it go, like, they had free trials where you could play for, like, a week or a month or something yeah. like that. It's like, okay, I'll try it. I downloaded it. And I could get it worth the wine. And, you know, my patience with wine is it didn't work out of the... Mm, fuck it. And, well, anyway, Reddit, Linux WoW Classic players were getting targeted by Blizzard because there was that DDoS attack and they're like, yo, this is coming from a bunch of Linux boxes, you know, not people playing the game, but hey, Linux is going to serve, son. And while well, it was doing its job, just not in the right way. So, you know, they scanned out, what was it, the TTL headers? Yeah, uh, the packet uh, TTL headers, uh, they were trying to flush out anything that would come from a Linux box, just drop it. Um, yeah, this was, this was the countermeasure that they took, but it was only for IPv4. So this entire thread was going on. People were trying to figure out workarounds. And effectively what happens is Honey Linux don't give a fuck and gives you full access to the network right. stack. So you can just mm -hmm. change the packet TTLs to be whatever you want. If you change the Windows value, all of a sudden their DDoS shield thinks, oh, this is coming from a legitimate client. Also switching to IPv6 seems to have fixed it as well. Though that's not uh, that's not usually an option for everyone because that's kind of dependent on whether or not your ISP will actually give you an IPv6 lease. But um, yeah, this was the this was the workaround established. And yeah, I mean, from 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 a, from a very simple operational perspective, this change on this change kind of makes sense. If you're getting attacked by a bunch of Linux boxes and there's no real way to fingerprint which ones are legitimate and which ones aren't, uh, identifying something like a common packet uh, TTL is a is a useful way of dropping all the bad packets so that your service doesn't completely degrade. One hundred percent. I had a bit of sympathy because I know Pennywise and Shadow was very excited about this. He's like, I'm going to lose all this. This is going to be his thing. And then we just go like, motherfucker. <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> oh, I feel bad for you. But 100%, I would have done the exact same thing. This, this was damage control, man. This is like, hey, stem the bleeding and we'll do the triage in a minute. So mm -hmm. I, I just saw a lot of people on the internet, on the interwebs, Going, oh, well, this is another attack against Linux from Blizzard. I'm like, man, go fuck yourself. All right, I, I hate Blizzard as much as they're just shifty and shady as they can be. But not on this one. Don't hang your head on this yeah, one. Yeah, I, I However, mean, they're, they're... Pedro was all like... I was all like, this is the third time that Blizzard have done uh, or have served uh, Linux users with 
a very nice and long shaft for them to shove up their own asses because they can't or won't do their job properly. And yeah, the, eventually they did get around to say, oh yeah, we're aware that this is affecting legitimate uh, Linux users who are trying to play the game honestly. Uh, so we'll see if we can work around that. But yeah, the, this is exactly the reason that I still haven't bought Diablo 3. Yeah. Well, incidentally, uh, what I was going to say is in the thread, they were saying that Diablo 3 was unaffected and people could still connect to Diablo 3 and StarCraft through Wine. Um, yeah. Yeah, I mean, you you can you can definitely make the argument, and there there is some legitimate support for it. That this was a very heavy handed approach, but again, when you when you're dealing with the DDoS, right? It's mm -hmm. distributed. You're trying to identify the least common denominator and be able to continue serving stuff. How do you guys feel? Like, if I'm playing something with wine, if I bought something with the intent to play it with wine, and it breaks, I'm like, yeah, all right. Well, especially if there's a if there's like a server component, like a server like an always online DRM, like an MMO or like something like Diablo or StarCraft, that's kind of the risk you're taking. Is that's, it's, yeah. they, it's kind of what I was trying to risk. say. I mean, yeah. I feel yeah. the like it's a gamble. Ca caveat emptor, it right? Is. Like, mm. and you are trying to do something that is not officially supported, and you need to keep that in mind. Hey man, uh, mumble. People use that to talk to each other. <laughs> still, people and, still indeed. use that. <laughs> well, some some people have some issues with uh, Discord, and they might be legitimate. They might not be. But mumble has a new version. It's one point three point oh. It's been a long time in development, but you get fun you features hear that, such Captain as Archer? <laughs> right. It's been a long road. No, um, what, uh, a couple of the uh, highlights from this release. Uh, individual user volume adjustment is added. So if someone in the mumble channel you're in is being extra loud, then you can just turn them down. Hopefully it works a little bit better than Discord's because that one's not great. Um, no. There's also an improved band Has, hammer. Um, does, does anything, have you ever used an application that had AGC that worked? Anyways, all right. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, there's there's also some improved uh, moderation tools with the banhammer, uh, and they also have an option now. You can toggle it, so uh, you have to go in. No longer do you have to go into a menu to disable push to talk. You can enable a menu option that will make a toolbar icon to toggle push to talk, which I guess is a nice feature. But I think that kind of should be a primary one it, it's kind of like progress that's one thing i've never enjoyed about mumble and it's like no hold down the button or sign a key to, like, i don't have time for that man if i want to talk i'll like talk yeah i, I get um, why it's there but yeah. still. and uh app images they're they're shipping Neat. the game the app as an yes. app image which is handy if you don't want to compile things or go through your software your uh, your distribution software repository i'm done with that App images, yeah. they work, you can love them or hate them, and you don't have to install anything else. It's just, oop, there it is, done. Indeed. Lutris is a new release, too. Man, it's... all right, yeah. You, you hear me? You sentient baguette dropped this release like halfway through <laughs> last week's show. It's like, nice. Right, man, yeah, not 5.3, uh, tell me about it. Indeed, my my upcoming roommate has a uh, has a new uh, release. The, 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 who will be sleeping on, all oh, right, hang on, we, 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 it's, the, all right, all right. This was a great chat. I, I just happened to catch it in Discord. Um, you know, Matt, you will come in on the, the creator of Lutris. He's going to yeah. WineCon, and the, Patsy was like, should I get a motel? Or then Jordan's like, wait, do you want an air mattress? How, how did that roll down? <laughs> yeah. Like, hmm. yeah, well, well no, because like I, I, I was thinking about it. I, I looked at the calendar, and I'm like, oh, shit, Matthew's going to be here in a month. And if I need to buy stuff for him, I need to, like, put that on my to-do list now, or else I'm just going to fucking forget. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, do you have, so I'm like, straight up, do you do you have a hotel booked, or do I need to buy an air mattress? <laughs> <laughs> do you think, uh, air mattress? Right. Uh, yeah, yep. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm, I'm going to go order one on Amazon. I'm, let's see if I remember to use our affiliate link, which, by the way, you can use if you oh, want to buy right. stuff off Amazon. Yeah. Yeah. Plugs uh, aren't over yet. You see. thought you were out. But... Oh. oh, you think you're done now? <laughs> Boom. There's another key. Um, yeah. So uh, check uh, this out. Do you think you could order? How, how small of an air mattress do they sell? I'm going to get a doggy bed for him. Oh, my, oh dude. Don't. Just, just get like a swimming pool float <laughs> and tell him it's a mattress. <laughs> I'm 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 gonna get him like an like a, a mirror style anime body pillow and that's just gonna be it. Get, get, get the bull float with a cup holder. He'll love it. <laughs> Indeed. All right. Yeah. 
I mean, we, we, we could just keep rocking and rolling with Lutris, not 5-3. Uh, there's a D9VK option that you can enable globally. You don't have to do this on a per runner basis. There's some wine large address aware stuff if you're running 64-bit OS, which, you know, you probably are in 2019. I know you 32-bit holdouts are still out there. Just fucking upgrade already. What no. the hell? Um, the, if you're using, um, AMD GPU pro, uh, there's, they've added that to the Vulcan loader search. So you can actually use the proprietary AMD drivers. I don't know why you'd want to, maybe if you need that 5,700 XT working right this instant, there's a brand new logo, but it's not the logo that it should have. It needs the empty logo with the otter and the human teeth smoking a joint. Nay, I like my master chef. That I made all those times back. Oh, yeah, it 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 need it needs more sunglasses and Strider holding guns. One hundred percent. One thing is we were just talking about app images is they are getting the bits and bobs ready to ship a flat pack version. Of Lutris, Indeed, which which will which will I be very handy. Strider was a big fan of the snaps. No, what do you think that? <laughs> Uh, I mean, the, the reality I, is... I you like could... your strategy. It's like, I just made it up, man. Come on. <laughs> the, the, the reality is, this is a Python program, so you really just got to clone it and run bin Lutris. Pretty much. And, yeah. But that's available for your consumption. Okay. Maybe, maybe, event, maybe eventually it'll have the workaround so you can play WoW through it. Ooh. Ooh, tie it back. It is that one thing where you can play the happy. goddamn Batman. This is true. Yeah. All right. Le Batman. <laughs> Okay, so RPCS3, uh, they finally got around to publishing their July update, and with this one, uh, they have a lot of fixes. Uh, some, they fixed their MSAA implementation uh, to allow certain games to actually run properly, and they've even gotten CSAA uh, working properly, which is needed for games like Gran Turismo 6 and Gran Turismo Academy. And GTA 5. Yes. Kirby GTA the Acid Trip. Oh, Rainbow the Cars. <laughs> you know, but you yeah, can get a uh, paint job that does that in real life. You have to pay a lot. Yeah, for, that. for a lesson. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, they also uh, fixed uh, something that they had introduced, uh, one of the features that they had introduced in some of the past releases. They also fixed that so that games like Dragon Ball uh, now actually work properly and there's no weird clipping issues of stuff that shouldn't be there showing up. So that's all working properly. Uh, we, it also affects... Go on. Uh, it, it also affects uh, other games. Go ahead. <laughs> I was just going to say, the other thing, uh, we talked about this on their last pro progress report. They're, we're, they're investigating some methods for ensuring that you can play PS3 games uh, outside their standard resolution and frame rate, because, you know, you have a modern computer that can run games at hundreds of hertz and hundreds of frames a second, but the PlayStation 3 was not designed for that. Um, so they've made a little bit of progress. Um, you can now adjust the V-blank, which should help some games run at higher frame rates than 30 FPS. Um, and also, uh, you, there, there are some that actually tie frame rate to the actual real-time clock, so you can change what a second actually means to the emulator hmm. so that you can yep. run the game faster. Um, this allows, like, uh, what Pedro was salivating over, uh, Dark Soul or Demon Souls at uh, UHD at 60 FPS. Yeah, it's like go, go, Demon go, what, Souls. What? You, you Even running that there. at 720p, uh, it could barely hold 30 because... That game was just poorly optimized from the get-go, but Wrestling. I saw the video and the dude was playing it like 3840, 2160 at 60 FPS. It's like, <gasps> I wanna... I All right, wanna. so now you gotta wipe off the microphone and your desk. Hot. <laughs> dude, it, uh, it just keeps chugging along, man. I, I'm glad they didn't decide to do the... the Beautiful minds behind this weren't working on a Nintendo project, right? Oh, yeah, <laughs> they they would have been sued so much. Smoldering crater. <laughs> and the only reason that Sony isn't suing them is because they tried to sue um, one other mm -hmm. emulator in the past and they lost. Yeah. So if, if, now if, they're if it's a complete clean room implementation, then they can't do jack shit about right. it. Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, they can threaten to. Yes. Yeah. Lit lit litigate. Don't innovate. That's right. Hey, cloud gaming. We we don't need Stadia. We'll make our own with blackjack and clouds and emulators. Yes, oh, uh, mad because clouds, bro. this is what this is. This is uh, Cloud Retro, uh, and it's a cloud service that you can deploy yourself, and it lets you um, set up your own uh, cloud for 
emulators like your ds emulators and your they show a lot of nintendo screenshots on that uh github page and i'm just thinking oh god <laughs> when when is nintendo going to drop the lawyer hammer on this one <laughs> Well, that's when you got to start paying attention when they're in legal trouble. That means that they have a viable product. Yeah, yeah. it's like clone to get now. Clone it. Do it. <laughs> that means it's one point oh release. Nintendo decides it, it, that. Yeah, it it, it it's funny too because like the, the Valve almost takes the opposite approach. It's like, oh, hey, you figured out this thing to use our system? Yeah, we're gonna bring you guys in. Mm -hmm. Nintendo's just like, mm -hmm. no, you're not allowed. Our our shit needs to be <laughs> yep. pristine. You stay away from oh, it. Oh man. I don't know. I mean, game development company. How very them of them, man. Indeed. But yeah, if, but yeah, if... it's Cloud Retro. It works off of Lib Retro, obviously. So anything that Lib Retro supports, you can deploy. It's it'll be like a teeny tiny little server that you run, and then you can access it through a browser and play it. Do they mention browser. anything about bandwidth requirements, or is this a house cloud? It's, uh, this, I think it's right now it, it is going to be for a house cloud, but mm. you could try and deploy this, you know. I, I mean, for like general. Nintendo, for like NES games or Game Boy games, I think if it's not something that's super twitchy, you should be fine. Maybe, maybe try it in the backyard first. In, right? in, 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 yeah. yeah. It's yeah. like, give it to your neighborhood. It's like, connect to this. What, 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 one, thi <laughs> one thing that is, in, is interesting they listed out as a feature is they have like a Twitch Plays Pokemon mode so you can actually have multiple people control the same game, which is pretty fucky. That um, sounds like a brilliant idea. Let's never do that. NVIDIA tried to do that, but it never came to Linux. <laughs> Twitch, Twitch Plays Doom 2016. That's the thing. Coming up next, Slipstream was my favorite version of FTL from, you know, Star Trek as opposed to Warp Drive or Trans Warp. It's also a Java game where you drive cars, throwing chairs at it. In an app image. Technically true. I mean, <laughs> I mean that's, th it doesn't make it any less of a Java app. <laughs> you still, you still, the, the, the startup command in the Java app is Java jar, so. No, dude, it's like, you can't see me, no, no, no. <laughs> it's lib gdx i mean as far as java goes i guess that one technically works <laughs> I think I get all this crap set up. oh hey if you want to play the home game check this out we can go over to vote.linuxgamecast.com where you can bang suggest show titles and we can vote on indeed them. Boop. there have been a couple of people suggesting stuff let's see what we got we got mm. i don't know ben what does that say <laughs> I, I, Scott, I don't speak weeb. Uh, is it trackball or mouse? <laughs> I'm gonna give herbs. I'm gonna give Poutine inside a uh, book because that's my favorite <laughs> Ulver album. Huge in Japan, where moose? Probably yeah. a giant spider. <laughs> right. It's Japanese for big. <laughs> Big. Okay. <laughs> Big. That's a lot of kanji for big, but whatever. <laughs> it's a it's a big word for big. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't type little. <laughs> little big. Like the like the arm architecture, little big. No, like the uh, Russian band. Oh yeah. With like the 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 two ladies, one's the tiny one, one's a big one. They make really good music videos. I'm a sucker for a good music video, man. It's it's becoming a bit of a lost art. Yeah. Oh, there's, there's hiragana in the middle. Okay. <laughs> what? Only one of those is a kanji. The last two are hiragana characters. <laughs> no, no people in Twitch. <laughs> We, 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 we're just done. We're finished. Bye, guys. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, Bye. Back, back, back to what Pedro was saying. <laughs> what? <laughs> there is at least three kinds of characters in Japanese. There's kanji, hiragana, and katakana. <laughs> we... <laughs> Thank you. You're There's online, probably ladies. more, but those are the three I'm aware of. <laughs> Okay, now I'm gonna need you to go and commit seppuku. <laughs> can you spell? Can you spell that in hiragana, and then go kill yourself? 
No. <laughs> and they use the Latin one. It might as well be an official character. I don't know. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> we summoned them all. We fight. We fight. <laughs> we fight. We fight. Oh, man. That's what we got to do. Scale is get like a like a inflatable pool, fill it with Skitty, and like have a weeb fight. Film it. I don't see an issue with this. I don't either. Man, have you ever committed Sudoku? <laughs> Once. That was my first um, programming course in university. The there was like the end of the year project was write a program in C that would take. A text file with a Sudoku um, matrix, and it would resolve it. And I did. <laughs> Mazeltov. And that's how I got my degree in literature. Um, in um, single in complete, core, yeah. uh, I think it was a Pentium M, like Centrino back in the days. Uh, it did it in 1.33 seconds, like the regular. Eight that's kind of that's actually kind of <laughs> bad. Sorry, nine by nine. <laughs> nine by nine. We're talking about two thousand and five. Yeah, that's still bad. No, dude, he wrote it in Portuguese. <laughs> uh, it, it uses Portuguese numerals. Right. It got thirsty a couple of times. Um. <laughs> yeah, single core, one point three or one point four gigahertz laptop processor. <laughs> Man, I remember the. Single core days, they're dark times. Of course, everyone gets uh, that single core treatment. What we used to before we had D nine VK or no salty. I still don't have the boots because I still don't have an email. Well, I did get an email, and they said it's like, oh, it'll be another four weeks be before we have any size nines available. Tomorrow, when I'm done with this, I'm gonna at reply them and ask them where your damn boots are. <laughs> I asked. I sent them an email because they have the little contact thing. It's like, okay, look, I want to buy some boots. What do I need to do to buy some goddamn boots? Size nine, okay. please. Like, See, oh, then what we gotta do is we gotta, we gotta contact them and get them to change the shipping address to my address. All right. <laughs> so that I can just be like, hey, Pedro, I got your fucking boots. <laughs> what if we can get a boot each? Ooh. <laughs> we, you we have to go like, on a quest. Get a shelf for our backdrops and just each other. Yeah. Boot. yeah. I'm not above asking Solovar if they'll split a boot order. Yeah, no, if we, if we explain to them why, why we're doing it, I'm sure... I, I think we can make friends. Yeah. yeah. That's something I would get behind if somebody was like, all right, fair fair enough. Yep. I'm half tempted to go with the 9.5 uh, UK size and just get some inner souls <laughs> and just go with that. Yeah, right, I gotta get the videos loaded. I'm gonna get another one of these. Mm, I'm not running Ubuntu. What is this false advertising? I'm running Windows Vista. Why is the Ubuntu thing over you? I have no idea. Is this the overlay from when Jill was on? Yes. That that's my guess. Possibly. Let's find out. Doop. To the chair overlay. Oh. Hmm. Maybe. Why do I have the chairs template? Nope. It's not that. <laughs> Categories. That one's right. Yeah, but it's just... Nope, not that. Hey, OBS, it would be really handy. Like, you'd throw me a preview window. Cheers template drop. Nope. Maybe I was just... Quick oh, on that, that bit right went to crap on the return video. <laughs> yeah, it did. Good. Too much pixels! Um, 
Hmm. Okay, fine. There's an easy way to fix this. There you have you, Dell. <laughs> yes. All right. <laughs> I am Fedorf. Fedorf is me. That works. I've I've opened my third eye, and it's sponsored by Red Hat. Man, I'm I'm just proud. <laughs> Of like this is gonna require refined motor control. Yay. It was made in the build engine? Yeah. It was it was made in like six build engine. <laughs> Lib GDX. You, you had Java, you had a modern J, JDK running on a ZX Spectrum. <laughs> wow. Wow. Did you have a full gigabyte of RAM? Just tuning Hi, in. <laughs> hey, Amen. <laughs> it happens. Listen, we're just about to worship our Dark Lord Satan. Linus. <laughs> Satan Linus. Half Linus. Half Brood Witch. St it, it, it's Steinus. Man. It's like when it's when oh, Satan it's and Linus do the <laughs> do the uh, fusion dance. Fusion. One here's like one of the things, man. Um the Mc McDowell's is going to start testing AI powered drive through order taking. So when you pull into the drive through, instead of like, hi, hey, welcome to McDowell's, and we'll it'll be like, it'll be like, Siri, you got me a hamburger. Pretty much. I'm going to try to order a brood witch. No tomatoes. <laughs> you have to eat the sun dried no. tomatoes, then. I don't like them. No, you have to eat them. You have to eat them, then. You have to consume the entire brood witch. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> I did it. We're here. Yeah, I really do need to put this uh, hood to wash. We all do. Yes. We all do. <laughs> the funk. <laughs> Girl, you got them pants. Skirt. Locked and loaded. Recording live. In three, two. Man, I got them pants. Skirt, welcome to the chair acquisition, where we throw chairs at games and we see if they work on Fedora, Solus, and Debian. And then we ask, is it fun? I don't know. We'll find out. This week, we're taking a look at Slipstream. It's developed by Anzdor on LibGDX, which is basically just running Java in an app image. You can pick it up for about 10 bucks US. What is it? Archide style racing Archide. game inspired... Archide. Archide! <laughs> um, inspired by the spirit of the early 90s. Yeah, it's advanced technology that we nice. have. It's advanced Java technology. Um... With uh, drifting mechanics and exotic tracks. Uh, the devs did send up some keys for this a long, long time ago, so we got to thank them for that. Uh, so let's get started. Have this thing run on Debian. Man, you mean the better um, Linux operating system. Check this out. Uh, over here on Debian 10.1, that point release did rock and roll. On the Threadripper, 1920x, 32 gigajoules RAM, NVMe drive, all that hotness with a 2060 display at UHD. It always launches in left monitor. The one I have in portrait mode showed us, so that got old quick. 
I have to unpicken it, drag it to the center display, then re unpicken it every single time the game launches. If I want to play in full screen, now if I want to play windowed, but what's the point of having a 43 inch monitor if you're not going to play pixel games yep. in full screen at <laughs> UHD, right? Performance wise, 60 at 2160, 60 at everything else. Uh, it runs well, it should. Graphics, look at it. It it's hipster pixel, man. There's nothing necessarily wrong with that. However, there are options for like CRT effects or pixel effects. Don't you dare touch those. <laughs> I mean, go ahead and touch them. Just make sure you have like anti-nausea drugs laying around. Controls, I tried it with the Xclone controller. It worked out of the box. However, unfortunately for the QA, I can't give it a solid, clean bill of green, wet, stinky health because that left monitor thing needs fixing. But I'll give it a solid three. Yeah, on uh, Fedora twenty, uh, uh, it's thirty now. Fedora thirty sixty four bit with the i seven six seven hundred K with the uh, Spectre mitigations turned on, and the GTX ten eighty Ti. Yeah, it, it, it launches. Definitely does. It definitely likes that leftmost monitor though. I fucked around with uh, setting display variables for like maybe twenty minutes yesterday, trying to figure out if I could get it to spawn on the correct monitor. It will not. So there, that that's half a chair off. And then you got to enable virtual controller. Uh, Pedro will talk about that a little bit more in his mix with the working segment, but that's that's full chair off mix with the working. It doesn't work entirely out of the box. Performance at 1080p. Yeah, it it, it runs. Look look at it. Uh, graphics. There are some really really smooth animations that don't juxtapose well with the pixel ant with the pixel art, and it's a little jarring. But otherwise, it's fine. And um, yeah, Pedro. Like I said, Pedro will talk about the uh, DualShock Four issues. But after you enable that, it works. So four chair or three chairs. I know how to yeah, over here I have if there's one thing I learned from Linux all these years is that uh the leftmost monitor is always the primary primary monitor no matter what you tell X. So that's what I do. And I have the UHD monitor on the left. So it launches just fine uh in Solus with the GTX 1080 and the AMD Ryzen 7 3700X. Uh, the performance, yeah, it's locked at 60. It's not going to do anything else. The graphics, yes, they're absolutely retro-tastic. I mean, look at that. Uh, and the controls, yes, like Jordan already hit it at, uh, to get the DualShock 4 to work, I had to go into Steam Big Picture mode, go into the controller configuration, and force enable uh, the um, emulation thing that Steam does. Basically, it just tells any controller that uh, Steam input is compatible with to just use Steam input regardless of which controller it, it is. So it'll just emulate, like, a Steam controller. Speaking of the Steam controller, that one worked out of the box. So, four chairs. <laughs> well, there you go. Java under Linux still has a ways to go in terms of gaming. Do you, you have fun with it, Ven, though? Man. Did you drift? Tokyo style? I, I kind of like these games for their simplicity. Um, however... To touch on something that you brought up, I mean, yeah, something does look just a little off with the pixely car and the relatively high res track, followed by the pixely sky map in the back. It's not anything wrong, but you can make everything hella pixel. Put that CRT effect on there, but the screen becomes nope soup, a nope milkshake with such a quickness. It's like, what the hell? Hard mode indeed, ladies and gentlemen. That's for the game itself, man. This is cruising USA on a pixel budget, son. Um, it's not necessarily a bad thing, but you have to keep in mind, games during this era, you know, the era that Slipstream's trying to emulate, had one purpose, to eat your quarters. So keep that in mind, because you have dick AI and, unfortunately, hella repetitiveness. That's just the thing, that's reality. Not to say this is unenjoyable. Nay, Slipstream, perfectly fine for a pick-me-up and drift only to get dicked over by a stupid monkey truck at the end of the track because that happens a lot. What I'm getting at is it's a wee repetitive. And I found myself having to play it like in 10 minute increments, chunks, if you will, because that's the way I had to roll with it. It's not something I could just put an hour straight into. But after getting the drifting locked down, because that's basically the mechanic in the game, I kind of felt like it turned into a shmup on wheels. Again, maybe not necessarily a bad thing. Maybe not what I was expecting. Um, it does have a couple of racing modes. That's neat. And the option for local coupe. No online. Mm, kind of sad about that. It's not bad. It's not great. But if you're into retro racing, 999 It's kind of a fair price for what it delivers. 
So all things considered, uh, I think I'll be able to give it a solid two chairs. Yeah, so the name of this game apparently is ABD, or Always Be Drifting. I can't really comment on the verisimilitude of the driving and the handling, because I don't actually drive, but I'm pretty sure physics don't actually work that way. Uh, but, I mean, it's, it's, it's a car racing game. The whole spiel that Ben gives at the beginning of any, like, roguelite or RPG that re we review applies to me here. I don't oh, really dear, like the racing games. <laughs> False accusations, man. <laughs> these, those are my favorite genre things. Right. Yeah, ra ra racing <laughs> games aren't my aren't my jam. This one's okay. I spend some time practicing tracks and time trial, and then I can do okay in the campaign mode, which apparently has a story, which I'm just going to go ahead and assume is a love story between a man and his vehicle and a very, very hot exhaust pipe and some third degree burns. Uh, but yeah, I can't, uh, it, it's fine for what it is, I guess. It's not something that I'd play regularly or at all if we I weren't actually doing reviewing this for the show. So, I mean, I'm gonna give it one chair, but don't pay attention to me. I hate racing games. Listen to these two yahoos. Thing one and thing two, they seem to like them. Yeah. And this is very much drift or lose the game. Uh, it it gets a bit infuriating at times when you know random uh, traffic vehicles that have this nasty habit of swerving into you or just showing up in the exact lane that you happen to be doing the drift on. That's kind of annoying. Uh, also, no matter how they do it, if an AI car hits you, you're the one that slows down. They hit you from behind, you spin out, and you slow down. You hit them from behind, you slow down. So there, basically, there's a lot of from behind fun. here. Yes, <laughs> and it's uh, I get it. You know, back in the day, uh, the CPU cheated a lot, and it would use any and all um, chances that it uh, would get to dick you over. And clearly, they're going for that old style of game. So I'd say it works, but it's still just as as annoying and infuriating in 2019 as it was back in 1992. I did very much enjoy the racing when I wasn't, you know, crashing into traffic. And even the uh, the retro graphics feel very much appropriate for this one. It is like OutRun, but for nowadays type of computers. So I, I enjoyed it. It's not perfect. I screwed those traffic cars clearly. Uh, but yeah, it's the non traffic it three cars chairs. you have to watch out for. Uh, hey, the flying cars <laughs> at nine bucks. I, I wouldn't be against having it. It's not something that I'm going to put a lot of time into because there's not much to it. And that's not knocking the game. The game did what it said on the tin. It was like, yeah, this is like mm -hmm. the old games. Yeah. And we're going to stick like to that. So it's like, like a or, racer or whatnot. Yeah. Then yeah, like then the, the, it, it, this is very clearly trying to be a Genesis game, and it, like I, I would say it accomplishes that for better yeah. or for worse. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Keep an eye out for it. I mean, if this is your jam, this will deliver. Um, for me, a little bit more in a racing game, but yeah, I get what they're going for, and I think they nailed it. So yeah, I would like to see an updated version of uh, Overtop. If you played, you know, a lot of Neo Geo arcade games, you know what that one is. I, I, I still want to play that. Mm. All right. Well, there, there you go. It's a passable 16-bit racer. Make of that what you will. Coming up next, I am the Lizard Queen. And the Sildat will explain why. <laughs> True story. I'm sad that didn't return a picture of Lisa Simpson, because that's what I was quoting. <laughs> I How is that lizard? lizard? <laughs> I have questions. It's not even a sexy lizard. There's no lizard about that. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, there's only so much you can do with the um, that format, you know? Yeah. I mean, if you put on a jetpack, you call the game Harrier, Space Harrier. Either that or you pour Rogaine all over the car and you drive around Harry car. It's so called Harrier. <laughs> you see, gee, I, I was reminded about the Gran Turismo... Um, 
Because that was a game where you had to drive sideways. I remember trying that over at a friend's house. I was like, fuck this. this uh, I remember there was a game called Power Slide. It was, I think, the last uh, glide game that I ever played. Oh, I thought it was like competitive White Castle eating. Yeah, no, when, no, no. When, I, when, I, when I hear <laughs> Power Slide, I usually associate it with cock push-ups, so... <laughs> But yeah, no, it, the game was called Power Slide, and that's all you could do because the cars had no grip. Like, zero fucking grip. <laughs> you so much as hit one of the turn buttons and the car would go... Whoosh. Okay, alright, we're sideways now. <laughs> that's the one. <laughs> you know what we need to fucking play is the... Uh... We need to do that. One day, um, get everyone together for some jelly car racing. The Jelly Physics racing game. Oh, yeah, the open world one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, online forever model. racers. Yeah, yeah, forever racers. Yeah, yeah. Fucking nightmare game, I loved it. Well, all right, that was a strong <laughs> word. I tolerated it very, very well, <laughs> swimmingly. I played a lot of it. Uh, I was kind of a big fan during early access uh, when they added the extra tracks. It's like, ooh. <laughs> I would very much like to play that too, North Ranger. I think Power Slide works uh, on Wine now properly. <laughs> there, For the there longest was a, time it didn't. <laughs> there's a fighting game on Kickstarter that was sort of like... Um... You remember Power Stone? Yes. No, the the other one. No, oh, no. Yeah, it was it was sort of like a Guilty Gear esque fighter, um, but I don't I don't think that one got a Linux version. Yeah, Mir, what I asked for was a modern version of that. Can't have it. I played a lot of that. That that's the thing. That's the machine that ate my quarters at the arcade. That's the one. <laughs> the one. The one for me that did that was like, it was, it, I, f I forget what it was called, but it was a Sega, like, mech fighting game. Hmm. Um, Virtual Lawn? Maybe, I don't, like, I, I have, I have, like, the recollection of me at the arcade playing it, but I could not tell you what it was called for the life of me. No, that's not it. <laughs> Shinobi. No, that's, that, that's, that's the division, Pedro. That's a completely different game. <laughs> Same thing. You ignorant slut. Hold on. Did it look like this? <laughs> maybe? That, well, we got a definite maybe. Yeah. <laughs> that's Virtual Lawn. And yes, okay. that game was freaking amazing. It came out on PC, and it does work with, in Wine, if you like, 800 by 600. See, it's yeah. not what I That's was expecting, because from you, I was hearing Virtual Lawn. I was like, Get off my Virtual Lawn. Right. On. <laughs> All right, let's take a peek. Uh, we got five minutes to count down, so... What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Vote.fortexgamecast.com Cast your vote. All right, <laughs> fine. <laughs> Tell Ox. I can feel the poutine inside. <laughs> Probably oh, a giant God. spider. Stupid monkey truck. Fuck jacket in me. Uh, mm, all right, fine. 80... <laughs> go go. Eighty percent chance of vaginal rupture, <laughs> which is an actual statistic for birth. All right, and we have one more segment, so we'll rock that at the five-minute mark. So what do you think the, um... If you want to play the home game, the battery life is on a wireless, this wireless fucking fuck you keyboard. Uh, what does it take, Someone... like two double A's? Two triple A's. Two tr ooh. Mm. A month. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with, uh, two months. Okay, um, I'm gonna help you out a little bit. It's measured in years. Uh, One year. One year. <laughs> Two years. One point five years. <laughs> One million years. They say real world average is closer to three years. Interesting. 
I mean, it's it's so a fucking keyboard, right? So the batteries will right? go bad but... before it actually drains the charge of. Well, it uses okay. a Bluetooth LE, so. Uh, I thought it was the Wi-Fi Direct. <laughs> no, this one is how this connects. Ah. To this. Jesus yeah, Christ, dude! <laughs> it's fucking Microsoft, man. What the fuck? Are you Why? <laughs> And I don't even know what this uses. I just plugged the fucking dongles in. By the way, they both work with Linux out of the box. Just plugging in. I mean, most human input devices will work with Linux out of the box. Never fucking assume that because then that motherfucker will not work until you I make said, some I new said devils. most. Right. Most. <laughs> Hashtag most. <laughs> oh, dude, I fucked up some Golden Axe back in the day. Yeah, that. Um, like Golden Axe, yep. Yeah. <laughs> Shinobi. Oh. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time. No, wait, not Turtles in Time. Yeah, was it Turtles? No, maybe it was. The one where you, it started out where I think your first boss was like, uh, Bebop. I think that might have just been Ninja Turtles or Ninja Turtles 2. Yeah, I don't know. They had, uh, at one arcade, like, uh, Afterburner was a big one. I remember they had the, um, immersive one that you could sit in. I never fucked with that one. Mortal Kombat 1 I was down with. MK2, by that time I had it on the Genesis. So I didn't play it a lot. Yeah, something like that. Scott. Very much so. I had that on Genesis too. That was a really good port. Well, Genesis kind of really opened it up, right? Because the it Genesis was 16... is the sixteen-bit one, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm making sure I'm saying it right. Genesis slash Mega Drive. Yeah, it's like I figured everyone's watching. Yeah. And the Master System was like the NES equivalent, like that was yeah. the eight-bit one. I, I always get Mega Drive and Master System mixed up because wasn't there like another? What was like the fucking Voltron, uh, Voltron Sega Genesis thing where it like you could hook up the Genesis and the 32X and the Saturn and the CD and the? But that was just a regular one, man. Because yeah, you could put. The, I had the Sega CD and the 32X, yeah. and I also had a power-based converter, which allowed me to play the original Master System games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you could you could straight up do the Sega Tower of Power. Right. And knuckles and knuckles and knuckles and knuckles and knuckles and knuckles. <laughs> you you could have three legitimate wall wards. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Tower of Doom. Yeah, and uh, a Sega kind of screwed up that release. Actually, a Sega kind of screwed up all their console releases. Uh, but with the master system it came out just a year or two before the mega drive or the genesis so it's like oh so now we have a 16-bit machine that is clearly better in any way but there's still active support for the master system so what do we all think about the north american release of the dreamcast turning 20 years old this week my cousin had a dreamcast that was the only person i knew who had one i knew one person with one I was. Yeah, I, think, I, I think we all had that one had friend or family to buy member. Another console. It was the PS2 that won out because that I was like the clear it. winner. I think I that was around the time I had a 3D FX Voodoo three, but I remember playing like um, Toshiden or something like that on the. I was like, oh, this, this looks better than what I have. What? Yep. That. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah Brazil. You, 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 you could stack the. Uh, <laughs> See, I didn't have the old... What I did is I traded my original one uh, ah. with the volume slider on it for mm. the updated one because my Sega CD was the side one. So you had to have like this janky-ass extra piece yes, screwed yeah, into the, the side. That, that, that was the one that I was thinking of, the side-loaded one, not the mm -hmm. bottom-loaded one. What was interesting, too, is that like the N64 had that, too, in Japan. There was the 64 Double D. Mm -hmm. uh, the, Majora's Mask was originally released for that. Um, the... Um, well, like the Excite Bike for the NES, because they had a bunch of floppy games for the NES in Japan. Yes, the, it, it wasn't a floppy. It, well, it was a floppy disk, but it was like the Nintendo floppy disk. Slightly disc. fucked up one from like yeah, Fuji. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Then piracy and all that. The, the, it, was, it was the Nintendo disk system, I believe. Tis true. Yeah, the fa fa yeah it was Famicom disk system, because it was... The 
It was the family computer. Back when consoles were home computers. Oh, I never had <laughs> Back one, when but... consoles were being marketed as home computers because game consoles had flopped massively in 1983. I knew Dude. a couple of people with the Super Nintendo floppy disk adapter so they could play their pirate games. I, I, I knew I knew one person who had that too, yeah. Wonder how Twitch chat looks in IRC. What? Don't play with yourself, Mr. Lur. Come on. <laughs> Shat bridge. Twitch we can bridge. go deeper. <laughs> we, 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 can, we can go deeper. People who are listening, or people who are participating via Twitch chat, we've gone through some lengths to bring you into like the whole <laughs> milieu. All right, let's rock and roll. Oh God, History Channel's recommending me. What do, Ancient Aliens, what is the Ark of the Covenant's true purpose? Oh my God. I kind of want to click on that. <laughs> Man. It's three It's three minutes. Oh, am I going to regret it? I can watch, I, dude, no, I just can't do it. Like the Ancient Aliens, man, it, it, I love cheesy conspiracy, but like Huge that humans. one. Dude, it is just like it. It's just the way the show's paced. That it's like, what if, for like for every five minutes, yeah. it's like, and what if, and like, what if fucking Batman walked in there and shot your ass in the kneecaps? Well, no, but it, it's it's always what if mm -hmm. after this commercial break. <laughs> I don't know. All right, it's the thing. Let's do some hate mail. Yes. Now, Pedro, remember you have to vomit blood now. Chunky. Chunky. Chunky the, all right. Um, Jordan, I, I think you get an NA on this one. What was the last time you like drink to the point of um, vomit? The last time I did that, um, I think was in like 2007. Feel free to participate, Pedro. Uh, last time I did that was in 2005. Because, <laughs> like, I like I, I, I because drank, I a, drank little... a whole jug of wine, a five liter jug of wine by myself. That didn't go down very well, mm. and yeah, it came back like, up. <laughs> I, I, I straight up just like quit drinking um, in like 2010 ish. Yeah, I just like I, after, after after like doing like college parties and whatnot. It's just like you know, alcohol's not for me. Yeah, oh outside of like um, forcibly doing it, because like I can't go to sleep with this much alcohol in my system. I, I definitely had that. But... Yeah, I I think I tried the once to put my fingers on See, my throat and nothing Basil came knows up. what I'm talking about. <laughs> Tactical chunder, baby. Yep. That's yeah. It. I was like, yeah, we want to wake up. Kinda, we, we, so. we, we, we need to make some room and then we can eat more. <laughs> All right. Feel the chunder. Good to go. Let's do it. Let's pull this nightmare into the mm. station. Mm. We work at the cable company. <laughs> In three, two. And this particular Saturday night chunder is over. Do you feel uh, If you'd like chunder? to know what the hell we were on about, go back and listen to the show no. again. Mm. You know you want to. Ah. Oh, yes, you do. Dude. But. After you Bye. do that, make sure to go to LinuxGameCast.com, hit the contact button, and fill out the form. Just make sure you're sending some hate mail over to the LGC Weekly show that the little selection box, uh, selection box allows you to choose. And uh, yeah, that's basically how you do it. If you're a game developer <laughs> and you'd like us, <laughs> you'd like us to have a look at your game. Again. <laughs> hey, uh, that's you one thing you need to send access. us three keys or a build that we can share amongst all of us. Yes. Because if you don't, well, we're just gonna make fun of you. And call us up; we'd love to have you on the show. No, we'll get back to uh, entertainment value. Probably the next two weeks until I get readapted to typing on a split keyboard again. Me typing show notes, fucking hilarious. Oh yeah, <laughs> it, I, I mean that, that that it's the same thing like when you use uh, the Google Voice keyboard, where it's like. 
I assume Ben was shouting this at like the Google Home. <laughs> it, it's a delicate mixture of that and like that's close enough. You know. Yeah. <laughs> if I'm just talking well, to you guys, I'm like, you can decipher that. Sometimes. Right. Sometimes. 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 Yeah. Sometimes. <laughs> All right, if, if, if you go back into our hangout chat, there's some wonderful like, <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> and and anyways, we, we got we got two. We got the first one this week. Uh from RK. Tech Tops. This is it. Tech Tops. He says, uh, yeah, I saw and commented on the Linus thread, uh, m -m -m for me, the Switch came full-time after about four years as a dual booter. I honestly switched full-time for a number of reasons. Security was one, memory efficiency was another, but mostly control over my system in a way that multiple sclerosis will never offer the end user. Uh, workflow was never an issue as my work uses Google Docs spreadsheet and pretty much exclusively for internal and external reports. Gaming has gone to the point where near native, it's near native for a large number of games, Easy cheat and other middleware being the last stumbling block doesn't really affect the games I like. Just nice to have the best compatibility. This is in response to that uh, Linus Tech Tips um, <laughs> Twitter thread we were talking about last week, where he's like, "Why don't you? Why do you use Windows? Why is it better than Mac or Linux?" So, yes, yeah. dude. I mean, it. I had to quit. That 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 was me watching reality TV. Was just reading through that thread because it just yeah, never but, kept giving. Yeah, I, I read through that and then it, it really floored me where, when I realized that Snooky was a Linux user. It made me really reconsider some life choices. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, it explains your new boat. Um, coming up next. <laughs> up next, we have the Sildat and he's talking about uh, Jordan being a Komodo dragon. Howdy, y'all. Uh, just watched this week's LGC, and I must say I'm surprised that the new Armello DLC introducing new heroes didn't make it in the news this week. Yeah, what the fuck's Indeed, up Indeed, one would think that an entire DLC dedicated to introduce venomous, treacherous, sneaky reptilians would have grabbed Jordan's attention. Come on, we all know that this uh, anthropomorphic Komodo dragon of a wizard, Volodar, uh, in that DLC is Jordan's secret fursona. Well, scale sona, but... Yeah, first soda. No, anyway, it's a scaly that, furry. keep on rocking, guys, and curry. have a good weekend. So I, I just and, gotta say, are you implying that I'm a Komodo dragon because I don't brush my teeth and my mouth that is a toxic mess? So when I bite people, they just die. No, it's because you bite people's ankles. It's weird. Stop. <laughs> it tastes so good, though. I no, love every I love that fucking sweet time, ankle dude, juice. Out in public, he nibbles on somebody's ankles, falls them around for like three weeks or two, but the restraining order, whichever comes first. And he's like, I don't understand. <laughs> I, I genuinely don't. I genuinely don't. Just give me just give me your ankles. So, yeah, boy, do you guys still play the armadillos? Yeah, uh, we we do. Uh, we we I think we talked about it briefly uh, on one of the Thursday streams. Um, it was it's actually like a paid DLC. It just adds a couple more characters. Um, yeah, we uh, the next time we play Armello, uh, we might install it. Uh, we we usually tend to use Armello as like a filler in between like other stuff that we're streaming. Right on. So. What, the, the next time that pops up, uh, we'll, we'll we'll give it a whirl. Apparently, it changes the mission structure too, which is interesting. I don't I don't know. It's an interesting I, game to watch. I don't mind watching you guys for a little bit and playing that. Yeah, that it, I mean, it, yeah, it's, it's, it, it's, it's for me, game. it's definitely a watch Jordan play it kind of game. <laughs> right, because I don't I know it's not in the game, but I'd be floating around like a fucking ghost after. 20 seconds somehow <laughs> <Yes. and laughs> this this don't starve rule set doesn't make any sense then we're playing our mellow shut up no <laughs> ladies and gentlemen on that bomb show let's cue the music you can always find this nightmare train pulling off the tracks at 8 30 uh hour before that if you want to hop at our discord uh we do our pre-pre-planning show of nonsense. We just talk about whatever's going on. It's not planned. It's not scripted, but it's all nightmares. It's fantastic. If you want to get in touch with me, I'm at Vinstone on Twitter and just at Vin on Masta, LinuxGameCast.com. Say hi, and I'll wave at I, you. I am your favorite cold-blooded lizard boyfriend from Canada. Uh, you, can, <laughs> you can follow me on Twitter at the Burning Fool. Or on our Mastodon at Frojo at mass.linuxgamecast.com. And maybe I'll bite your ankles. Maybe I won't. You can only know if you've joined. I honestly don't know what I'm doing here. But hey, I don't, I don't if either. for some reason you enjoyed my contributions or lack thereof during the show, feel free to follow me at unaccounted for on Twitter. That, that, that's usually the best place to get in touch with me. Um, lads, 
What was learned other than Jordan is, in fact, a, a, a flat moon theorist, uh, but that explains the lizard person ankle biting. Oh, it's the Liz. Oh, flat moon theory, baby. All right. Ooh. Boop. <laughs> Look at all those executive producers. Oh, quite, we, we got rewind, rewind it. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> rewind. <laughs> Live, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, bitches. <laughs> two, two real vending machine, two real vending machine. Got to thank all these lovely people who are making this possible. Our executive producers who are giving us boatloads of moolah that we Make continue to embezzle. Uh, we got, we got, uh, who, who do we got? We got Arthur patients. and we got Mr. Fox Dog, Empty, the Atomic Ass, Mike, uh, Barb Ramt, <laughs> Aldius, Hoplo, McGeek, Scoots, and look at our wonderful producers, like Jupiter All Broadcasting, the producers. or D-Mentor, or Lutris, or O, Ramswata. <laughs> the Admiral JT, Ertain, the Scott Ryan, Linux Noob, the Linux Noob, the uh, the other Jordan who's not a Lizard Queen, Jolly <laughs> Pablo, Yabo, Langston, the Targos, Zoe, Massivoni. Gonzo Nibbles. 2000. <laughs> it's better than Gonzo 1999. There's fewer Y2K bugs. Yes. J Girl, Vertnog, Sorceress, Linux Noob, Dominic, and look at all the fuckos people who gave Adrian! us Adrian! hardware. <laughs> Don't tickle but, Frank. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna tickle him, Frank. Give, 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 give up those tickle, pits. Tickle, tickle, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna stick my finger in your pits. His stub, tickle, tickle, highly tickle, 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 tickle. Wait, wait Get a second. Here. Frank Danger doesn't tickles. have nerve endings. Man, that's what he fucking wants you to believe. That, that, that's racist. Wait, wow, Pedro. Wow. Just because Jordan. a man is a that's skeleton skeletist. doesn't mean that he doesn't have any nerves. All right. Hang Frank up. is full of nerves. Full of nerves. <laughs> I didn't say nerves. I said nerve endings. <laughs> They never end. They go on and on and on and on. I'm almost sorry. <laughs> no, you're not. What, a raccoon humping a pole? That's Ven? <laughs> I mean, that's not inaccurate. Oh, the humping trash panda. <laughs> More f <laughs> nerve loop fruit. <laughs> we made it. Yay. Woohoo! <laughs> 369. It's like a nerve Ouroboros. <laughs> nerve spaghetti. Isn't, isn't that what they sell at that Evangelion-themed restaurant? If you can catch it, yeah. It's a moving <laughs> restaurant. <laughs> it's highly they sell everything Evangelion. That's the thing. It's like Evangelion's been around for so long that they make everything as a tie-in. Including cars, yes. <laughs> and spaghetti. <laughs> can I get the um, spaghetti with the side of Akira? Mm. That's advertisers. With a side of Tetsuo! <laughs> Got it! Ah. With a side of Guts. <laughs> oh no, wait, that's Berserker. Never mind. Berserker. Did he just say making fuck? Yeah, I believe he did. <laughs> Berserker. <laughs> that's, that, is my, that is my favorite line from all the court clerks. He's like, did he just say making fuck? <laughs> oh no. My love for you is like a trumpet. <laughs> oh man! Did... Yeah, what happened to the uh, oh, remaster that they were doing? What? Oh, I thought it was that something was the... I had to do. You, like, what? Oh. You didn't watch that South Park episode? Right. Trap Keeper? Trap Keeper. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, the uh, Akira remaster. <laughs> Hello, my name is Bill Cosby. <laughs> <laughs> that joke aged well. Man, dude. So what oh, that's having? right. Yeah, Warhammer 40k. Ah, it's still 30 bucks, though. Mm. Warhammer 40k Mechanicus. That's the... Um, my one of my favorite things about the Imperium of Man is that um, they they outlawed, like, learning new things. So <laughs> the people the people who, like, make all the machinery work literally are just like, yeah, no, ghosts inhabit this computer and we have to appease the ghosts. Man, I hope society devolves into some shit like that. 
and I'm yeah. long dead. I just want to also afterlife. I want to be a ghost, spooky ghost. Then be like dumbass. Uh, smoked. Oh, the three turret shirt. Yeah, yeah three, baby. Three, three, three turret moon. I also have the uh, Cave Johnson and Cinderi Lemons one still. Science isn't about why, it's about why not. Dude, really? But it's not turned up. Huh. Interesting. Uh, restart Steam. Are you trying to make him play the game? It's not a bad game. Monster. <laughs> as, as far as, you know, racing games go on Linux, that one is not bad. Mm. <laughs> oh, you have restarted Steam. Okay. Uh, if you go to the shop again, does it let you hit the play button? That'll force it to show up on whatever list you have going on. XDG. Unless you have a filter set up and you're only looking at your favorites, or you're only looking at, like, a custom list. I don't mind the Dirt Rally, it's just... I'd probably like it more if I had a, like, full racing setup. I know for a fact I would like it more if I had a proper wheel. <laughs> but that would be like, oh man, I spent all this money and I did this and I'd be bored in 15 minutes. I'm like, well, that was fun. Um... <laughs> I'd be looking for games to actually try on that. There was a game I used to play on my Wingman Formula Force. Uh, it wasn't 4x4 Evolution, but it was in and around that time. And that game was amazing, and I wanted to play it so goddamn much, because it actually made use of the steering wheel, mm. and the force feedback was pretty spot on. Here's so my, it's like, here, Here's yes. my problem with force feedback. Every single one. I fight it. I'm like, you're not going to tell me what to do, and I will burn the motors out. <laughs> I mean, you're kind of expected to sort of fight it, right? Because it's like you have to keep it under control. <laughs> I win, dude. I replace belts. <laughs> yeah. You better pick and if you get, up. like, one of the Logitech G29s or the 290s, uh, it, yeah, they, it lets you, like, a couple of screws, pop out the top, replace the belts, pop it back in, done. <laughs> mm. Nah. I don't know. Uh, the third games work well with anything, even the keyboard. I was mildly competent with this keyboard. <laughs> I, I played it with the excluding controller. I'm like, ah, it's well enough, man. That's why I like arcade racing, because it was built to be driven with a controller. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, going back to the arcade thing from earlier, it's like, yeah, the Sega Rally cabinets, the first one, the Sega Rally 2 ones were crap. Uh, but the first ones were amazing. It's like, yes. Then we had like <laughs> Virtual Fighter. Oh, what was the Virtual Racing? What was that on the Sega System Board 2, I think? We'll find out if Alan's listening. Virtual Racing. Yeah, with the IndyCar. It was the first 3D. Daytona 60... USA? No, sweetheart. Way before that. Oh, I did like uh, Sega Touring Cars back in the day. <laughs> oh, I remember seeing there that. There we go, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was a thing. That was a breakthrough. And then they shoved it on the Genesis with like the super... No, the, what, what, they had a special chip put in there. I think it was the only title because I remember that game in store was 99 pounds <laughs> because of the yeah yeah oh it was on the model one all right on the model two Sega AM2 
60 FPS arcade. It, it was like, it's hard to explain. Nothing was like that. You're like, what is the spaceship that has landed? Yeah. I referenced cruising USA during the Cherquisition. Yeah, this one I spent a lot of time on, um, on the Saturn, because it, for some reason, it just talked to me. <laughs> Turing car? That's from someone's YouTube channel, but mm. yeah, you, you can see the level of polygons on the graphics there. <laughs> Alright, um... If you're in live, we're going to kick open the lines for the after shows in. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, run while there's still gens. Yeah, racing games for the Saturn. I had Sonic R. <laughs> Uh, and I beat that game with all the characters, including Amy's stupid little car thing that she drove around. I've while never... everyone else was on foot or floating. Tangled with Sonic Amy Racing, I did the car. Sonic Generations, and I got my fill of that. I lasted about two hours, <laughs> and I'm like, you know what, I'm good. Yeah. That was the first Sonic game I'd played since Sonic CD. <laughs> I kind of tapped out on consoles. Thanks, 3D effects. <laughs> yeah, I didn't do that until. Yeah, that was the last Saturday. console I. Yeah, it is. <laughs> uh, I think the last console I bought was the PSP. Oh yeah, you the had original that. one, the fat console. one in two thousand and five. <laughs> It's not it's technically like, oh, a console. <laughs> technically, it's a handheld gaming device, not a console. <laughs> well, actually. So, out of yeah, the I'm gate. Just saying, it's, yeah, just technical reasons. PS2. Look, you hang around, you well, hang around retro gamers a lot, you get a lot of technical... By consoles. the end of it, it was a full-blown handheld computer because you could load True. anything you wanted on it. True. Yeah, that, 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 little, like, that one was that, 2006? Uh, I think the first one came out in either 2004 or 2005, and then they had a bunch of revisions. Yeah, mine's a 3002. Yeah, I had the, the original Mine. 1001. It was a Europe edition. <laughs> yeah. Friend of a friend pulled one out, and he's like, do you have Wi-Fi? I'm like, oh, that has... Oh, I thought that's what I was thinking about getting one. I was like, how's the browser? He's like, that's rubbish. I'm like, oh. Browser yeah, rubbish, yes. it could browse the internet, and it technically had Flash, because Flash was a thing. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, it wasn't very good. <laughs> wow. Cruising around the PC I like, store, like, actually playing online control. games, because it's like, ooh, this yeah, is cool. technically playable. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Jill. Hi, Jill. <laughs> hey, Jill. <laughs> Hello, Patrick. Mir. <laughs> Hello, Jill. Wow, that Hello, did Scoots. not crack well. Wow. <laughs> what didn't crack well? My voice. Oh, don't worry, man. Wow. It's a phase. You, you'll grow out of it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that'll grow eventually. <laughs> Around Scoots. when my uh, mustache attaches to my beard, right? Oh, that's never going to happen. Give that dream up. Nah, nah. Thank you, French Explorers. <laughs> I've never watched that one. But I miss. I uh, don't even know where you're going with that joke. <laughs> never miss. <laughs> Scott, Scott was <laughs> regaling us with his tales of facial hair meeting. Like what? Did he did he like tie his beard to some other person's beard? <laughs> you missed no, out. No, no. So my mustache and my beard are two distinct entities. What are their names? 
Oh, you're, you're, you're the you're the kid Must who named their bear. hamster hamster, weren't you? <laughs> leave hamster out of this. <laughs> All right, I need to take a piss. I'll be right back. Right. You leave hamster right, seven out dog, of this. Cat, cat dog. Merc seven. You're like oh, you just put them in a can. All the hamsters. Cat dog now. <laughs> hamsters. <laughs> yeah, man, spider pig. Is that Spiders. is that like the monster uh, from Coheed and Cambria, except it turns you into a hamster? <laughs> Basically, man. I mean, <laughs> I don't even listen to Coheed and Cambria. I know that one reference because everyone's like, "Oh my God, you look like Claudio Sanchez." I'm like, "Who the fuck is this?" <laughs> Dude, you get that? I was thinking about that the other day. I was like, I wonder what my doppelganger is up to because I haven't heard from somebody who's seen who has seen me and stops me in fucking public and it's like, hey man, how's it going? I haven't seen you in like a week. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I don't know who the fuck you are. That that happens to me too, and it's like, I don't know. I feel I'm distinct enough, right? That it's it's hard to mistake me for this some. This is other. why I go. Dop I know this motherfucker lived on North Avenue in Athens. Like I this. Is, Probably 10 or 15 times. Mm -hmm. Seemed like a very nice guy. Everyone was very pleasant. They're like, where's my money? You know, I never ran into that. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, no, the worst is like when people start talking to you as if you are that person that they think you are. Yeah. I'm just like, yeah. Uh -huh. And you don't, you don't say anything because you're like try, you're trying to figure <laughs> out who the hell they think you are. <laughs> yeah. Yes. And so they, they just keep going. Dude, and then you get the ones where there's like a 50 who's like, I think I might know this person though. That ha that happened to me once because they were working security at a um at like a concert. Mm. They were like one of the ticket checkers or whatever, the guys who like check your hands for stamps or right. whatnot, and they're like they're like, Hey Jordan, how's it going? And I had this moment of like, who the fuck is this person? And how oh. do they know who I am? <laughs> and like it was bugging me throughout the entire concert, and I'm like, oh, I know who she is. It turns out she was a friend of my ex-girlfriend uh, who um, who my roommate promised to fix her computer, but it was just so fucked up that he's just like, you know what? I'm not, I'm not. Nothing a good go to fire <laughs> wouldn't sort. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like, oh yeah, I haven't seen you in like three years beyond that, those two times that we met before. So yeah. Some people are like good at remembering yeah, yeah I'm, I'm just I'm, like, I get confused with my brothers. Oh, if I, if I didn't see Jordan for two weeks, I'm like, who the hell are you? What? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <Ben. laughs> I have a. Uh... Taking all my brothers, going, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm not wrong, folks. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Having so many students a semester it becomes an issue, but I never forget their face, but I may forget their name, but I always remember where they sat in the class and if they were good students and did the work and it. Usually, you know, ninety-nine percent of my students are great. So, <laughs> name tags. But I, yeah. <laughs> we need well, to know more about that one percent, please. Yeah. <laughs> they were never seen or heard from again. Jill just killed them. <laughs> the penguin the apocalypse happened. <laughs> Meet me after class, and they were never heard from again. <laughs> Teachers were the worst to get me confused with my brothers. Oh, I bet, huh, Foxy? Because yeah. they always had me, and a couple of them had all my brothers, so they always go through them before they get to me. Mm. So their names, then mine. <laughs> I had one teacher. Yeah, Chew me I mean, Chewbacca doesn't sister. live on Endor. I like the blinking. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I, do, I do that in real life to people sometimes. Oh. Yeah, I, I usually am scowling. It's like my default. It's not. Oh, I 100% I have the resting bitch face. Yeah, it's people like leave... mildly irritated. And you're like, what are you upset about? I'm like, nothing. I'm just chilling out. But you're starting to piss me off. Keep going. I, I don't know. Do people do people think you are a good person to ask for directions? People just assume that I know where the fuck I am and where I'm going. <laughs> and it's wrong. So Man, if my spidey oh, sister catches that, that, that in a I'll long disappear. time, Poof. I, I think that phones kind of got rid of yeah. that particular. That happened to me in need. Finland, where people are like coming up to me and like talking mm -hmm. to me in Finnish and like, "Lady, I'm Aww. from Canada." 
You gotta get up more, man. It was the complexion. <laughs> yeah. And I mean, I'm I'm pasty. I have a beard. I walk around in heavy metal shirts. People just assume that I'm Finnish. <laughs> <laughs> I've been meaning to watch that um, what was it Finnish uh, comedy metal movie where they were doing that. oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. that, 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 oh, that yeah. one looks pretty good it looked pretty decent man bubbles ah uh, the bubbles. Powerpuff Girls man I want to see the version of the Powerpuff Girls where like all of Bubbles' dialogue is replaced with Trailer Park Boys Bubbles do it <laughs> <laughs> that's just some body kitties right there that's some good shit I have a I have a sneaking suspicion that the that like the episode of the Powerpuff Girls will not be substantially changed by swapping that dialogue. <laughs> Probably not, dude. That for its time, that show was unhinged a significant yeah. amount. Ricky, Ricky, Ricky. Shit, hurricanes coming, Randy. <gasps> Gotta the kill two on shit that birds with one shit stone. <laughs> The eyes on that guy are kind of freaking me out. <laughs> so, uh, Jill, how did you like Battle Angel Ilita? Ilita? I. Ilita? Yeah, it's, no, no, it's the Apple version. The Ilita. No, no, it's, 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 oh, it's okay. I13374. Oh, e. oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh, isn't it Attila? Yeah, oh, it's Attila. Attila. Battle Angel Attila the Hun. Right? Yeah. Yes, I would watch that movie. <laughs> It's Ilita. Get it right. Yeah, ba Battle Angel Alita. Oh, <laughs> Leader of the one eye. <laughs> yeah. Didn't you hear the Ilita? Alita Alita Battle Angel. Came out. That's the correct. <laughs> yeah. yeah. She's great. I love her. <laughs> Dude, okay. They were announcing the um, iPhone 11, I think it is, right? Isn't it the, the 7 or whatever? The new one. Or... Yeah. The, uh, the 11. The one after 10. It's got yeah. three cameras on the back. This is what I'm getting to. And apparently that has triggered people that have like the eye. I'm like, oh, too many pictures of eyes is apparently a fucking phobia. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Can be, yeah. Yeah, I had a TIL. It's like, fucking, of course. Okay, yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I see what you did there. I hate it, man. <laughs> yeah, pronounced Linux is Linux. Oh, let's all forget that horrible anime was there from Hidden. That <laughs> uh, vaguely addressed the actual source material. That thing went through production hell because the original creator wouldn't let anything happen to it. They changed one thing on it and he went absolutely ballistic, which makes it a small wonder that the movie was even made. It took Spielberg, man. And Spielberg oh, was like, hey, let's just introduce character. And he brought what's her name from the fucking anime back. Oh, the lady in charge. I don't even remember her name or what her character was, but yeah, that one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's like, okay, that's there. Hmm. What are your thoughts on it, Jordan? I I've never watched any Battle Angel, Battle Angel related material, so I have no opinion <laughs> on this at all. Do, do what I did. Thing, Watch a 15 minute YouTube video. It's like three episodes. <laughs> like three episodes of the actual animated. So man, I, I've, I've been going through uh, what do you call it? Uh, ideas of Ice and Fire's uh, analysis of the Dune series. That one's pretty good. Oh, okay, that's different. Um, that that the unrelated to YouTube videos dissecting things at length. I don't think I could do it for anime though. I don't care enough. See, look at this shit. I mean, the minute you brought up any sort of Japanimation mirror, that is that was Scott empty, dude. Ass. Or was it Scott? That was empty. Oh, that, that was, was empty. Was... Ha! Oh no! Learn to read. Say me what? Posting weeb shit. Actually, posting his that's collection me of weeb shit. Weeby. Yeah. Yeah, me is the weeby one, and that's Bubblegum Crisis. That one. It gives me the heebie yeah. weebies. <laughs> the original Bubblegum Crisis. Yeah. It's not artificial. No, nah, there's two versions. <laughs> the Canadian version? Oh, man. Everything needs a Canadian <laughs> version. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want Canadian Airwolf yeah, who just flies I'm around sorry, and says though. sorry. Yeah. I, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, Mirror. <laughs> Speaking of which, I, I don't see thing. Wintercell in here posting weep shit, so clearly it's just you. <laughs> 
<laughs> don't don't try to pin this on her because this is all you 100 <laughs> <laughs> percent okay we're gonna rock some rocket cars in the hunt man. i need to grab a refill and by rig hey. and uh might moonwalk for a little <laughs> while but i'll be back but are you okay would you tell us if you're okay i know I, i'm not adult enough to walk around in my fucking house with socks dude we almost learned this again the hard way because <laughs> Yeah. Some, someone I'll someone buy Ben morning. some baby powder. I've done Spread. that. <laughs> All over the floor. Uh, dude, I have marble in my fucking upstairs bath. Yeah, I, there's no like, whoa, I'm slipping. It's like, oh, hi, floor. Will you make me a sandwich? Yeah. I'm just going to fucking leave here for a minute. You, you, yeah, go, you go from ben. the standard amount of friction to zero friction zero, with no time dude. to adapt. Talcum. But yeah, I was doing some, I, oh, I was waiting for my slippers to dry because, you know, I got like the pool slippers and shit and the tops. So I was walking around the house in fucking socks. Dude, it was like 10 minutes later. I was sliding through those. I was like, yeah, this is why we don't do the take the fucking socks off. <laughs> <laughs> Involuntary demolition. I tend to be kind of lucky oh, when show. I fall, I end up uh, rolling out of it. And there was a couple times recently when I was falling on the ice that, well, recently, like, last year or two and I was falling on the ice in winter and it was uh I was on the sidewalk and it was just like I was walking and then suddenly I was on my back and I'm mm. like I know <laughs> I know. know something happened between here and there but I'm not exactly sure what all right Hey, Fortunately, yeah, when I you get the it, slush then... with the ice uh <laughs> under uh like just in between yeah, the slush and the pavement <laughs> It's like, oh, no, I just, look. I just mean, like, <laughs> I just haven't be falling forward because I know it was a slip back, like, my foot slipped back when I went forward. And then I was on my back and I, like, no contact to anything else. So, see, I, 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 I am massive enough in terms of I have the mass and apply enough force while moving that, like, if I go flying, I get a couple seconds of hang time to, like, reconsider my life <laughs> before I. <laughs> 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 <Yes>. <laughs> Jordan. <laughs> yeah, walking around in the UK during the winter, as Lur uh, has taught me how to uh, plant my feet. Actually, yeah, plant them. It's like walk, flat. Walk like a penguin. <laughs> yeah, that's the trick. <laughs> Turns out that nature kind of knows what the fuck it's doing. Yep. <laughs> okay. Control, are you gonna work properly or not? Because I'm not. Rotating the you say that, and yet Australia. <laughs> All the animals there. Yeah, no, they, they know exactly what they're doing. Did I miss, did I miss look, something? Look, look, look at the koala. They're like, it, it subsists on a food that is normally so poisonous to everyone else that they just can't eat it. And also, they're just drunk all the time. Yeah, that's yep. true. They are drunk. Same with Their the liver is just fine, going, mate. all right, we're going to undo everything that you just put into us, so give us a moment. <laughs> and also, they are so stupid that if you put food in front of them, they will not recognize that it's food because it, they need to pluck it from a tree to realize that it's food. Yes. <laughs> the bird gala, the galab, yeah, the birds of galas, they uh, fly around pretty much drunk because they eat the gum, um, uh, well, the flowers anyway. But Foxy, have you been eating flowers lately? <laughs> uh, not, not since this morning, no. <laughs> not since this morning. Isn't it? Look, isn't morning it was a morning couple morning. hours ago, Foxy. That doesn't yeah. mean anything. So, <laughs> four minutes ago. Uh, if anyone here is interested in uh, basketball, um, nope. no. this tweet, this tweet nope. is something. Yeah, I, 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 saw, I saw that. It's a robot fucking a crab. I don't know. I come back to this. Might have been poop. 50-50. <laughs> but yes, I, oh, yeah, I saw the totally bulls. Is. Yeah, I, I, I was oh, walking yeah, and I was like, that. are we going yeah. to? Uh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, robot fucking crap. <laughs> so breaking news, I just went and checked like emails and shit when I was making a drink. We've just been invited to become a Twitch affiliate. That didn't take Woo! as long as I thought. Woohoo! Awesome. <laughs> That's it. Affili Play. Affiliated or partnered? Affiliate. I don't know what the difference is, if I'm being honest, but that's what the email said. I didn't read it. I just read the headlines. Yeah. I feel like it's the first step. Apparently, we have mm -hmm. enough people watching to justify that. I don't know. 
Yeah, they actually offered me part, uh, sorry, uh, affiliate as well back when they first started them out. And my uh, check it stream was just an over it. Uh, so I started going through the application and then seeing all these little IRS forms. And I'm like, I'm Canadian. Nope. <laughs> I'm not going to deal with <laughs> So we know how to steer Sky. Uh, what was that? <laughs> Paperwork. Well, yeah. it was also uh, <laughs> just as I started my job, right? My, Man, my the IRS is job. so is so underfunded that it can't do anything anymore. So don't worry about it. <laughs> I love the American IRS. They're like, "Hey, man, you owe us money." It's like, "Oh, are you gonna tell me?" They're like, "No." It's like, "Don't you know?" Yeah, but you gotta figure it out. I'm like, "Okay, what if I fuck up? You go to you go to prison." <laughs> like, okay, <laughs> weird flex, bro. I'll try. There, you, 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 you can you can thank corporate lobbying lobbying and into it for that one. <laughs> Okay, let's get to uh, rocking and rolling. Hey, we're doing good, dude. Just, just turn in the loving. 11. Playing with the mm -hmm. boys. Yeah, XLT oh. helped us with that affiliate, being active in Twitch chat. Yay. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. <laughs> good, oh, well, good, good job. One or two people. <laughs> X sodium chloride. Yeah, me, <laughs> me and him and a few other people yeah. have been going back and forth. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you very much hmm. it's happening well you can you can send us bits and cheers and that's okay we're good <laughs> well like, we'll ignore them <laughs> it'll still be more than um youtube so it's more than well, well let, 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 let's find out if we can if we can breach 13 dollars then <laughs> yes. Actually, uh, one of the cool parts of the affiliate was uh, you get priority. I'm not sure if they if it still matters, but uh, uh, the only reason we want it is so it'll do the breakdowns for our videos, so when we can go back to streaming 1080p and it'll break it to 720, That's what I was gonna say. Yeah, right. that was the thing I was right. looking forward to on it um, because I had to. Mm -hmm. uh, I had to send it out one, and if I would have changed. Like if I would have done as high as the YouTube encoding, uh, I think Mir and some other people wouldn't be able to watch it. So I was kind of stuck doing a low quality Twitch stream. Uh, but then um, they offered affiliates and that was the one thing I was willing to go for. Cause I mean, chances of me getting enough bits actually at the time bits wasn't involved, but like, you know, yeah, we definitely, really, bits was involved. I mean, it'll break your stream down if you get enough people watching. It's a little bit orange Jesus. I mean, it was like what, five years ago when we were streaming to Twitch. I mean, it still does it, so. Man, the, li the live show was a very different animal back then, though. There's a lot more fucking yeah. around watching random YouTube videos. <laughs> yeah, because, you know, that's before the internet, like, turned into a cop. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Yep. I'm a you gotta tell me if you're a cop, though. Right. You went to war? Yeah, we need Twitch emotes. Although they don't transfer to our bridge. Yeah, we're no, not doing we're that, so don't worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I mean if, I if so. someone wants to make some custom emotes for us, we can have them. How about that means you're well, we in charge just of, copy, all of that period? Just sure. copy the ones we use on Discord on Twitch. Just use the same ones. Couldn't <laughs> be asked. Bunch of elves with demon horns. <laughs> Hey, empty, yeah. get your ass in Rocket League. Well, why you keep telling me to, now you get your ass in there. Thank you. Your ass to Mars. Uh. <clears throat> the kindness of Australians is legendary. <laughs> yep. We're a bunch of assholes, we're a bunch of cats held. I mean, I mean, oh. I, I mean if, you, if, if you've been watching Preacher, you know what duplicitous bastards they are. Pretty much. Man. Oh. <laughs> So... Do we lose Pedro? <laughs> no, I'm still here. No? Oh. Maybe, maybe look. Um, <laughs> I'm, I, I'm trying to find him. He's, oh, there he is. Boop. Yeah. He's a little though. A little Pedro. Well, yeah. he's it's it, it's picture it's Pedro in picture, right? Pip. <laughs> <laughs> Pedro. Pedro. No, Pedro and Pedro is the Pedro Ouroboros or the Oro Pedros. Pedro Boris, yeah, Pedro Boris. Oh, Robo Ross. Yeah, <laughs> that sounds better. <laughs> Pedro I think that's rough to end up. A, a Pedro Bias strip is when you like fold Pedro in half so that you can't tell what's the inside and what's the outside of Pedro. <laughs> that was Actually, a no. Good one, Jordan. Ah, math jokes. Dude, d don't, don't, man. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay. Let me grow. Okay, she's about to burst. <laughs> <laughs> I was promised no math. Don't worry, I just tapped that mute button, fam. <laughs> Yeah, but what if they don't add up? <laughs> All right. Yep, let's move on. That was horrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I was trying to be not, you know, a bit more delicate than that, man. <laughs> Come on. Manners. Granted, that's the show, but still. <laughs> there you go, Please. Foxy. <laughs> Fine. Please go fuck yourself. Thank you. <laughs> Sent you, Harry Crutch. A very different uh, Canadian SMR. Canada, Canada SMR. <laughs> <laughs> what, just someone walking around in the snow? No, it's just someone, like, it's just the mouth noises of someone eating poutine. Right. <laughs> oh no 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 oh. so what would My a poutine eating contest entail would would, would there I, be I, categories? I, I guess just eating like a, a like i guess you could have like a giant bucket of poutine and whoever finishes it first well okay this is like what i'm genuinely thinking about oh, is there like different God. grades of viscosity for poutine I mean, gravy. for the gravy? Okay. One, two, three. Is, is, like, is there like a heavyweight, like a 50 weight versus like a 10W30? <laughs> no, I, I, I think you'd have to break it down in terms of like the cheese curds, the fries, and the gravy. Because mm. you could have a combination of like, you could have like really thin fries with really thick gravy. Right? So. All right. I, I, guess, I guess the standard poutine would be like crinkle cut fries. Mm. Like a standard viscosity exo gravy, and a cheese curds. That that would be the standard poutine. Like gravy. So a while ago, I was actually that. watching. God a, damn you, uh, Jordan, for making me hungry. hungry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Some, sometimes like you can four get like in the, the morning, man. What are you doing? <laughs> well, I'm I'm just talking about all the fancy poutines you can get. Like sometimes you can get like the butter chicken curry poured over. Um, Poured over the fries instead of like regular gravy, and that's pretty good. Pedro, it, it's not the sexy gravy talk. It is the um, mm, ethanol being gravy. converted into sugars, which your body is now craving carbohydrates. Ooh. It's too. the fries. It's yeah. the fries and all of that. That's going. It's like, oh, I need some of that in me. Like, and it makes yesterday. me happy because you're going to open your ice box and look into it longingly and disappointed. No, that's I, the I, thing. I, I, My I, I, I has. <laughs> Some I, oven <laughs> chips that I can just put See, in the oven, when, and when, all of a sudden you get fries. Right, now I know it's going to be five o'clock in the morning, and you're going to be fucking up some crisps. Uh, uh, Goddamn right! <laughs> I, I was, was going to say I, I, we should we should make an album called "Sexy Gravy Talk" that's just full of like Barry White themed Canada songs. Do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, poutine. <laughs> Pour it ow, on. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Melted hot. All right, let's see. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, I can spectate, motherfuckers. There has to be a song tailed Beaver Tail. <laughs> Perfect. I'm gonna leave Scott. that one alone, Scott. Yeah. <laughs> Too easy. <laughs> Too easy. <laughs> Thought I'd throw that one out there. Hey man, we, are, we, are, we already effort. hit our we already hit our Beaver joke quota earlier in the episode with Don't Starve. So <laughs> <laughs> don't start breathing. <laughs> don't start breathing hold on to that don't. feeling right <laughs> okay word of the week beaver let's see how many joinable by beaver. party only mutators let's see when 1804 came out and they decided to call it bionic beaver and I said on the Wednesday show I'm pretty sure that's just the name of a porn movie and as it turns out <laughs> it is <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't be surprised with that night. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, sit back, relax. We're about to go into rocket time. I thought we were going to go into beaver up. time. Nope. Beaver time's over. Beaver. Get your rockets out. <laughs> Too sexy for Twitch. Rocket beaver. Rocket beaver flying through the sky. <laughs> no. Guess I didn't get an invite. Oh. What? But, oh. Oh. Wait, what? Hold on, I hold on, God damn it! Jordan. I, I didn't get I didn't get the uh, blue from guy. Steam Overlord. Oh, I gotta restart Steam then. <sighs> <laughs> well, we all need the match. well, let me know Take when you're two. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> I can't. Listen, hey, everyone, calm down. Jordan's new to this. <laughs> it's, it's his first time. Be gentle. I was, I was straight up in Rocket League. I guess Steam kind of hit offline. Uh, my controller, no worky. Why? Oh, yeah. I, I, have fun with that. Oh, God damn it. All right. Fine. Keyboard and mouse. So... <laughs> damn it. So hard mode. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. He made it. Bloop. Oh, okay. There that's you the bell. Fancy. Now I can't playing. join a party. I'm already a member of Party Hard. <laughs> you're in. Don't worry. You're about. in. <laughs> yeah, you're there. Leave it alone. <laughs> party oh, Hard. Sorry, <laughs> you got a party oh, hardy. Oh, with the <laughs> keyboard and mouse. Infox Ooh. Dog is in an online fucking game. Oh, fuck Foxy, me. back to the main menu. <laughs> Who was I just playing against? We all left. <laughs> it was it was the ghost of Venstone. Stone. Well, I just scored a goal with North Rangers and I. All right, I'm about to start kicking yeah, people out of the party, so. Yep. <laughs> all right, I'm in, I'm North in. Ranger, I'm out, I'm go back, back to the main menu. <laughs> I, oh, that's I who I was up against. Okay, North Ranger. <laughs> Yep. Now, am I going to try and drift in this game like I had to in yes. the other game? Let's find yeah, out. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Different buttons, cool. though. <laughs> yeah. Well, this is going to be interesting. Uh, all right. We were waiting on... Boxing. Okay. We got scoots. All right. We, 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 yeah. <laughs> Let's just all let Scott do his thing. Go, go for it. Make Canadia proud. After you're done. Nope. Ah, that was useless. No. <laughs> no. no. Yes. Oh, God. Oh, oh Ben. <laughs> Shit. Nice, Ben. <laughs> wow. Ah, hell. Inside that was fever repair. No, it bounced. <laughs> Quit doing that. Boo. <laughs> I missed. Dicks. Oh, I killed empty. Hey, man. I'll back over for me. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, very good. <laughs> that, that was on me. Very good. Nice shot. That was on me. I was trying. It, ha it happens. You try to get in that, and <laughs> the ball just appears in front of you, and you're like, well, I've committed. I, I guess the only saving anything to that is like, I would have won it anyway, so. Damn it, empty. You monster. <laughs> you monster. Monster? Monster. Yeah, yeah, like Herman Munster. He's cheese. Wow. Yes, oh, very good. Yes. Scott, where were you? He's <laughs> the, Actually, on the other side like, of the. Me? Great, Alan. <laughs> this weekend, Alan just kills everyone. Don't you know? Scott's yeah, a that, that was a good. good... <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Look, nope. Good follow up, guys. Good follow up to uh, that. Um... I am. Scott. <laughs> Scott. <laughs> Dang, please. <laughs> Alan again. Yeah. Oh, I boop Alan into us. the ball. That's fine. That, <laughs> that works. That, that, was a, that was a chain reaction there. Yeah, I blame I, I Peter. <laughs> Whoa. Right, no. That works. Okay. I'm good. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> Uh, Damn it. Sorry, Scott. Uh, come on! Oh, no. <laughs> Whoa! I got smacked. Yeah, I get you out of the way so I get at the bull. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Oh, come on! No! <laughs> ah. Look! Damn it, Scott! Ha! Ah, Andrew, you <laughs> fucked up. 
Yes, I did. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no. uh, Not enough speed. Slow it down. <laughs> Oh shit! Yeah, well. Nah. Try <laughs> Thank you, Scott. Out, Thank you. <laughs> no, it was going in other way. I tried to hit it, but I had yeah, no that was me. Who did that? Bonk. No, Bonk. no. At the end, it was me. Nice and play. Yeah, <laughs> what, what, what you, you barely you touched the ball, Scott. You trying to have a sorry <laughs> off? I don't know what Scott's problem is. Use yeah. both of your eyes. <laughs> Quit playing with your feet. <laughs> I don't want to close my feet. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Mm, you're quick, yes, you're quick getting all those tickets. <laughs> oh, come on! Yeah, God damn it! Oh, <laughs> all right, on the board. <laughs> I stole it, but you know. I got this. You got it. You can do it. Nice the fuck out, I got this. All this false mm. hope from that one goal. No, I just vultured it. <laughs> oh, damn it! I tried. If we get two, we can really get the fault soap going. No. <laughs> <laughs> damn it! Fuck you! I'm not gonna let you hit it. All right, everyone missed that, so. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. All right, all right. Damn it! There we go. Oh. <laughs> Get off me, whoever that is! No. <laughs> no. Ah. Nice. Oh, I missed it. Go off MD. Ah, come on, I missed. <laughs> oh, no boost. All right, <laughs> didn't plan that one out, did we, lad? See, I would say I'm normally not this bad, but that'd so be a close. lie. <laughs> Damn it. Oof. Man, we really oh, like this back. quarter, don't we? Yeah, we no. <laughs> I was trying to get out of the way. <laughs> All right. Lurking. <laughs> oh, no okay. Patience, young grasshopper. No. <laughs> Yes, that was one of my favorite shows. It used to when when uh, Star Trek came, came into <laughs> syndication. That was the the show that they would always run after it <laughs> or Kung before Fu. it sometimes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then they, 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 in the 90s, we had Kung Fu The Legend Continues, which was my exposure to that. Yeah, that, that oh, was a okay. thing, too. Yeah, it yeah. aired right after Highlander. The only thing I remembered was that was a very non-attractive leading man. I was like, how did he get that job? <laughs> There's a lot of shows that are like, man, this guy's fugly. Maybe, I'm just saying, dude. <laughs> Dick. Ha! At least I hit you. Hmm. <laughs> Small victories. Petty man. Bling, bloop, bloop, bloop. That's going the right way. Oh. Not really. <laughs> Not really. Jeez. All right. Oh, I hit the ball. Hey. Oh, he's doing better right than direction. me. Doing better than me. <laughs> Come on, one no, bullshit point. One bullshit point. Damn, I didn't ah. kill anyone. <laughs> well, I got All right. Yay. Womp womp. <laughs> womp yeah, you did. Womp womp. <laughs> oh, I did hopeless. Not one. Why no controller, no worky? Um, enable or well, disable <laughs> your uh, Xbox controls in Steam Big Picture mode and make sure it's set to off. That's what I had to do. That seemed to solve it. I just said everything. Yeah, don't uh, don't force enable Steam input for Rocket League. That breaks things. <laughs> oh, actually, shit. That's another thing I hope they add for the library update. Is like integration of some of the features that you can normally get at only through Big Picture, like mm -hmm. all the Steam controller shit. Yeah. Yeah. That yeah, would nice. that would be nice to just be able to do that in the in the library. 
Yeah, that is kind of a bullshit stick. thing of like, oh, okay, let's go into the big picture mode for the. That, yeah. That's the one thing you go into it for. Yeah, it's like any any time you need to change anything Steam controller related. <laughs> yeah, just c please kindly Valve put that put that where all the other configuration shit is. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Or since you're changing the library, just, you know, whatever new options menu you have, make sure that the controller options are there. It's, it's exactly, nice. right? Like, it, it would be very, I think it would be relatively simple to implement. Yeah. Yeah, because you know you can already do it, because if you have a Steam controller connected, you can see the option to change the controller uh, yeah, configuration. I, yeah, I, I would like it so it doesn't bit. pop up, like, the mini big picture mode thing, too, because that's annoying as yeah. well. <laughs> Like, Listening valve. Just, Jordan wants to use Steam controller in the library with kernel mustard. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not a it's not a completely unreasonable request. Not terribly. And... Gaben should be amenable to acquiesce to your request. Okay. He should, but his nipples might say otherwise. <laughs> Let's have some fun. Let's fuck around for a minute. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> Yay. Spiky bullshit. <laughs> oh. It's yeah. the Tonka Toy Oh, cool. <laughs> Hot Wheels. Wheels. Woohoo. Oh, God. It's it's not on ice? Nope. <laughs> oh, no. I'm a monster. <laughs> it's the puck. Oh, not on ice. <laughs> Banana puck. Grass. <laughs> oh, God. They have Scott and Alan. We're fucked. Probably. Not gonna lie. And it's just high gravity. It's not like a hundred percent. It's not a hundred times Earth's gravity. This is yeah. some Kakarot shit. Just some bullshit gravity. No. Damn Bad it. Pedro. Damn it. Give I it away. No boost. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, dang it. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I had no boost. I had no way of ex getting towards Pedro. I was trying my damnedest. <laughs> Tried well, to save, but there was effort. You lost bikes just at the right time. Yeah, an, an <laughs> attempt was made. Mm -hmm. Nice, Pedro. Okay, <laughs> more of those, please. <laughs> Good job, Ben. Yay! Yeah. Damn it! Oh God, damn it! Go empty. <laughs> God damn it! Oh, Foxy! Yes. Go Foxy! Oh, wrong way! I don't know! But, but, but. Help! Pigeon! Yeah. God damn it! Uh. <laughs> nice! Woohoo! Woo! Oh. I, no, I had no boost, and the, gra the gravity really kind of makes it Good essential hustle. to. Like, move. Uh, Pedro again! Yay, Pedro! <laughs> Pedro didn't have to do uh, yeah, fuck score all of that, please. He was like, I'll just drive it in. <laughs> I just gotta go in a straight line. <laughs> Hey. Ow. Foxy. <laughs> Come on, team. I am trying. <laughs> yes, that way, then. That way. Ow. No. Oh, oh, did everyone on our team leave the goal? <laughs> yes, yes, everyone they did. just fucked off. Yes, yeah. they did. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Don't want, don't want to have to make poor Scott dodge or anything. <laughs> now everybody. Oh God damn it. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> three, three, oh, three. Beautiful solo run. <laughs> fifty, fifty, fifty percent of the devil. <laughs> Half full. Yay, Jordan. <laughs> uh, I'd boost at just the right time too. Oh man, that's that's so crucial in this. Ah. I don't. I. Things. <laughs> Damn it! Oh fuck me! Yeah. Oh, 
Scott. Yes, very good Scott. Uh, <laughs> it's rather difficult. <laughs> Ooh, scoots. Nice try, North, North Ranger. North Ranger touched it, to be fair. Yeah, he did. Yeah. He did the thing. All hey, right. at least North Ranger stays on the fucking goal. <laughs> yeah, I'm on goal this time, so I'm what staying put. I have no idea what the fuck is going on. Keep looking at my keyboard, trying to find the R button. <laughs> no. I need the R button to get the spike. Ah, damn it! Hey, God damn it, me. Foxy touched me. <laughs> you deserved it. Oh, 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 I did not. <laughs> Oh. Is that your evidence that Yes. Bad touch, touch Foxy. Bad touch. Ah. <laughs> I swear I did not touch that man. <laughs> Regardless of what that doll tells you. Well, listen, man. Not every country has talking dolls, okay? Oh. <laughs> go, 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 yes. Yes. Almost. I got an assist. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I did a bit of a loop de loop there. I prayed I had enough boost there. I saw you, I'm like, shit, do I, do, do I have it? Spiky know, bullshit. Yeah, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. blew up someone. Uh. There's lot in life in this game. Okay. I guess shit. I'm back on net. <laughs> No! Oh, no! Good job, Ben. <laughs> Spiky bullshit. Spiky I'm pretty bullshit. sure that was either empty or Mr. Alert. Woo -woo. It that was, was Mr. really Alert. good, Ben. That was awesome, That, was, that wasn't even his did. fault. It just, it just got launched off him, of, man. Yeah, look he was at a, that. Wow. He was a ramp. That was it. <laughs> Rampo. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Rampo. It's, it's it's the Rampus. Oh, oh no. what the hell? No. <laughs> oh, oh, very good, Scott. Somehow I got the assist for that. That was not me, <laughs> even though it says it was. Iron Jesus. Come on. Come oh. on. Yeah, yeah, no, you were the last one to touch it. Mm -hmm. The trail was yellow, it, so that was you. I had no <laughs> control over it. It ricocheted uh, off. Oh, I see. Okay. The, the, it's called taking the points. <laughs> it's nice. called taking and shut up. <laughs> That's what Nori tells you every night, uh, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not every night. Take it Not up there. Night. Good Take times. it like a champ, and we'll all be good. Hey, Nada Duck. <laughs> Hello. Boo. Uh, I will have you to demolish someone. Shot. Well done, lads. Everyone off the goal. Go for it. Go for it, then. Go for it. Ow. Ah. Go for it, Ranger. Even though, why am I in goal? I'm on keyboard. Spike it, Jordan. <laughs> Uh, yes. No, not that way. Damn it. Uh, not that way, Jordan. Ow. That was me. No. Uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, fuck me. Go, Scott. Go, Scott. Uh, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I had no food by me anyway. You don't have to worry about it on our team. All you have to do is get the puck and just head towards the goal. Just drive it in. Yeah. <laughs> Who was supposed to be? Who was supposed to be on net that time, anyways? It was M. Fox. Fox. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's Michael. Michael's uh, just straight fucking off. No. <laughs> yeah, I am well next to bloody useless at this point. Boop! No, that button does that. Boop. That button does this. <laughs> Foxy. <laughs> Get out of my way, Scott. Why is Boost on the fucking mouse? <laughs> on the meows? Yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> meows. Right? Meows. There we go. <laughs> Thank what you, the whoever hell? that was of that the was purple Jordan. team. I think that, I think that was me. What the hell happened there? I could not see a damn thing. <laughs> yep, yeah. that was you, Jordan. <laughs> yep, you drove straight into the goal. And <laughs> boom. Yeah. <laughs> Although I think it was because the puck was uh, moving his luck uh, front wheels off the ground. Yeah, I, I, I had no, I had no drive. I, I was basically just going. I was, I was just trying to get some You're semblance of control. You have no drive. It's just. Ah, oh, God damn it, Mr. Alert, you booped me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, oh. Me. oh shite. There we go. <laughs> uh, I, nice. Uh, I was going for the puck, and you I think I didn't have Pedro. to break a sweat or anything there, did you, Pedro? That was pretty good. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I was trying to swerve, Jordan, <laughs> and I <Yeah>. did. <laughs> It showed me hitting you, but I'm not sure what I hit. <laughs> you hit the lag. <laughs> yes, welcome to my world. I played the fuck. 
face the puck. Eh, my pink is about as bad as Mr. Alert. Why am I here? Eh. Why am I doing this? <laughs> oh, God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, boo. Uh, uh, oh, He's showing damn it. The, <laughs> the, the real Hot Wheels logo. <laughs> good job, Foxy. Go, 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 go. Go. Right, right into the wall, dude. Come on. You got it. I had no boo, so what the fuck was I meant to do? <laughs> get, a far, get as far away as you can. <laughs> Which was what I was doing. <laughs> Someone catch right. it! Ah. Yeah, there right. we go. <laughs> uh, oh. Womp womp. Balls! Balls! When I'm the best scorer on the team, something right. has gone Yay, horribly wrong. Shit realm. <laughs> oh, Come on, get second. Oh. <laughs> I tied. For, I I got second for shots though. Right. Beyond Scott, who like fucking <laughs> applied yeah, effort. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And practice and is good at this game. Ugh. Practice. Practice. Fucking up the RNG for everyone else. Practice. Right. All right. Oh, well, I got drip shit. Now I'm going to make you motherfuckers play hoops. Then we're going to do drip shit. Oh, no. Hoops? <laughs> oh, no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to chalk up. Chalk. <laughs> Can we Delicious. do hoops with a square? <laughs> Lead gamer chalk. Or right. a cube in this case. <laughs> Nope, just a square. It's 2D. Just lays yeah. right over it. Can't <laughs> do anything balls. good. Right. <laughs> oh, man. Really does help with grip. <laughs> I feel secure holding this controller now. <laughs> That's so cool, Jordan. It works. <laughs> Talk. <laughs> If it, if it if it'll work for 600 pounds, I think it'll work for a dual shock. <laughs> you might be like, like, uh oh, there's the shock. <laughs> oh no, I've, I, I, I've, I've been, I haven't shat myself yet, but I'm yeah. not discounting the possibility. <laughs> this might be it, dude. <laughs> I've 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 had a couple of nasty farts, but not n never 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 shit my pants yet. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just glad we got to the fart conversation at this point. Yeah. Right? That's fine. <laughs> Brian Shaw shit his pants. Yeah, Shaw, something redemption. <laughs> <laughs> the Shaw shit redemption. Shaw shit redemption. <laughs> Are you happy, Pedro? You see what you you see what you cost. This is all you. <laughs> we can. <laughs> all right, Foxy on, empty. No Foxy. Yeah. But it's a cube. It's yeah, a big go. cube. Okay. It's a big Not cube. <laughs> all right. I kind of wish there was like a. Oh, oh, oh. I touched it. <laughs> yes. yes. Oh yeah. <laughs> God, fuck, nice shit. What, 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 what even happened there? You, you got slammed on. Boop. That was a porchy square right there, motherfucker. Look at that. Yeah. Boom. I, I, I took 1d6 damage right. there. Damn. Damn. That's, a, That's that 2d6. Cube. It's a great axe. <laughs> Ugh, damn it. Uh, great axes uses a d12, you dummy. Oh, that's a 1d12? Uh. Yeah. Great swords do 2d6. You dumbass. Yeah, that's all. That's all Jordan has, man. Let him have it. What the yeah. Hell? Yeah. <laughs> what happened, God. No. Yes. No. Oh, no. I am... Almost. <laughs> I, I touched there, it. I've got someone. Yay. There. No. Oh, it's almost... no. No. Yes. <laughs> we'll take it. Despite me having like eight chances to help. <laughs> you saw through nice, my incompetence. Empty. I'm so proud. Empty. Your companion now, cube was good for you. <laughs> now I'm just thinking about great axes and how they're really the only weapon that uses a D12. I don't even know what the fuck you're talking well, about. Well, no. barbarians have a D12 hit die, don't they? Right. Like it seems like that they, they they had one platonic solid that they really didn't use, and they're like, well, shit. Yep. <laughs> 
and let's create the barbarian class. It'll just use d12s for everything. Click. <laughs> ah. <laughs> you could have given me that one. We Wrong both way, know North I'm not Ranger. going to. Wrong way. <laughs> Trying to get some elevation. I'm doing something. No, what yes, you are. Stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> oh, stop it. Stop it, you bitch. <laughs> go. Oh, you bitch. There we go. Wait. No, not, not this way. No. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Mr. Lurd. That was awesome. Fuck off. Everything is awesome. Quit. Bye, <laughs> I, Ooh, fuck, this cube. Cube. fuck this cube. <laughs> it's the weighted come blamian cube. Uh, give me this one. No. <laughs> come on. Come along, cube. <laughs> hey, I want that. Come back. No. Oh. Ah. No. no. I still have no idea how this game mode works. Yeah, I know, but hey, man. <laughs> it hasn't stopped you this far, man. It, re it really <laughs> hasn't, but... Just keep rolling. Uh, at least, like, drop shot, I, I, I've i sort of developed an understanding for... <laughs> it, I at least understand what I need to accomplish. This... Oop. Wow. This, yeah, this is this. This ho hoops is its own special hell. Come on, please, put that in. Hoop it. Put the square Whoa. fleshy thingy uh, into the yellow <laughs> fleshy hole thing. Ah! Uh, <laughs> you monster. Aust Australian it anatomy is right like... Not this way, not this way, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, no. it's, it's, all, it's all upside oh, down. Thank God. <laughs> I was too used to driving on the ceiling. <laughs> oh. No. No. Oh, no, 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 Look at that, it's hanging on the edge. <laughs> Lead strands! Alright. That's, that, this is the appropriate direction. No, yes! No, Come on! Yeah. Very good! <laughs> Hide up. <laughs> That was me. Nice, oh, no. North Ranger. North Ranger was technically the last one to touch it. Right. <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> oh, fuck, man. Mm -hmm. I missed. <laughs> Went too high. <laughs> Much like Icarus, <laughs> I tried to fly with wax. I don't know what the valid strat is. It's going to like, just get under the cube. Yeah, <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> Except sometimes that doesn't work because it like hits a vertex and yeah. bounces. I, I just tried yeah. to be in his way. I'm just trying to annoy it. Damn it! I'm trying not to be upside down. Ah! No. <laughs> no. Yeah. Clear. I'm, at, this at, the, at this point, I just want to touch the cube. Oh! Oh! No! Try push it out. I launched it. But then Foxy touched it last. Then Yay, knocked Foxy. it into Foxy, and that's why it's his yeah. goal instead of mine. <laughs> that should have been mine. I deserve that point. That was my four squares. That was my 2d6 plus one damage. <laughs> oh, great X plus one. <laughs> Great sword, you dingus! We I just went over this. <laughs> <laughs> that one was deliberate. <laughs> Great. Yes. Oh, oh, come oh, on. Damn it. Uh, <laughs> no, motherfuckers. No, we don't. 
You know, this one would need. I, I, I tried to do something, but that. Hi, <laughs> Ben. Hi. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Oh, no, no. Bounce the other way. Bounce the other way. Oh. <laughs> 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 uh. Cocaine Voltron for the win. The Ben, ben stole that point for me <laughs> and gave it to Foxy. Get it. Yeah. yeah the, <laughs> you, you, you beat me because of Ben <laughs> stealing my goal from me. <laughs> Damn you, Chalk. You didn't save me against the bullshit that is yeah, you, you Fuck you and your safety, Chalk. Um. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, I chalked that one up, too. Yeah, I chalked that one up as a fail. <laughs> <sighs> I'd like to apologize on behalf of LGCLP. <laughs> and... I don't, we, 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 we didn't do the we forgot to do the zero this will not be a thing. repeat of last week it won't be con <laughs> i was thinking about do it. i can still do it i just couldn't remember the fucking title now i can yeah until tomorrow no, and no, yeah. no context yeah <laughs> zero context yeah <laughs> <laughs> But you know, there's like four or five people that uh, now are aware of that special gem. And they're like, what the fuck? <laughs> uh, All right. And. Hmm. Can I, can I use the controller now? No, I cannot. <laughs> what do you think? He's just going to like try it again and. It's just gonna start working, man. Or... Well, I've been Aww. fiddling around with the switches and buttons and all this. Well, see, that's your fucking problem, dude. My controllers don't have any switches. Well, what what are you supposed to plug oh, the, the network cable the... into? <laughs> all right. I'll... Dude, what are dude, you supposed to play Nintendo games nowadays? ISDN on? port. <laughs> As an uh... SPF, it takes it takes a fiber line. It's an adapter, dude. Yeah. It's a twenty-eight-eight baud modem. <laughs> it, it it uses RS two thirty two serial. It has one of those. RS two thirty two to USB C three point one to HDMI <laughs> to Ethernet. You get all the bandwidth to, to, to the Atari the Atari Sega Genesis <laughs> controller interface. Token link over string I two C over pigeon pigeon string. Uh, I'm not gonna... <laughs> Oh. A pigeon on a string. Yeah, it's not pretty. It's starting to smell. Uh, uh, that's what I want to see the next RFC for. HTTP swallow. over Mike Tyson. Oh, hell. Oh! Hi. Oh, fuck me. All what right. Giant ball, <laughs> light physics, it. and 10 times boot strength. And demolish on contact. Boom. Oh, ouch. Hey, points. Hey. Damn it. Hi, I'm Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Foxy. Okay, Did not so mean to do that. <laughs> no, 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 Neat. I believe I can pee so high. Ah. <laughs> ah. Hey. Damn it. Yay. Ooh, oh. That's a big oh. one. <laughs> Boo. Oh, yay. No, yay. Boo earns. Boo earns. Oh. Why am I on the ceiling? <laughs> I <bet>. Oh. <laughs> Sup, dog. <laughs> nope. I'm trying to get in a vague area of ball and so hopefully touch nope, ball. Nope, and... wait, God. <laughs> God damn it. I'm sorry, Foxy. <laughs> you got in my way. <laughs> and I got a North oh, Rangers way, apparently. <laughs> sorry. Oh, no. no, not that way. There's a big hole that way. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> boom. There's a big hole that way, too. Monster go boom. Gosh. Water go boom. I don't trust explosive water. 
I've learned. We will not repeat these mistakes. <laughs> Almost like hydrogen in the presence of oxygen is flammable. Ow. Hi, Ben. Hi. <laughs> hey, don't. Don't. North Ranger keeps blowing me up. Yeah. <laughs> really? Oh, fuck fuck you, game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking. Oh, God damn. All right, well. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it. Uh, yes. <laughs> Buckles, uh, yes. Buckle up, buckaroos. <laughs> Look how little we have on the shelf. Hey, Ben. Just a wee boop. Uh, no. <laughs> too little, too late. Less wish. <laughs> Less wish. <laughs> Twish, swish. Mm. It's the swish mish. Swiss, swish mish. Swish mish. Is that some off brand hot cocoa? Swish mish. Yeah. I don't think I put it in my body, but it's yeah, available yeah. for purchase. <laughs> Not without a. <laughs> I wouldn't put it in there. my body. I'll sell it to you, but I, I wouldn't use it myself. Right. Damn it. <laughs> Everyone just keep. <laughs> Everybody's <laughs> dying. <laughs> I'm just flying through the air for some reason. Well, I, I hit max Q and I was out of the boost. What the hell is that? <laughs> Hi, North Ranger. <laughs> I just keep getting I blown up. Hey, <laughs> man, everybody needs a hobby. It's yeah. with max Q design. <laughs> woo, 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 woo. So that yeah. they can stuff desktop, uh, top, desktop GPUs and laptops and just crazy <laughs> underbolt them. <laughs> Hit. Sorry, oh, Jordan. Fox, <laughs> That's all right. I've killed Foxy like four times. <laughs> so did I. Oh, ah! Oh, I, 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 I'm, I'm surrendering control of my life at this point. I'm just hoping for the best. <laughs> you and oh. me both at this point. Oh, no. Yep. Oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one. That's a big one. <laughs> what, what, what's a big one? Yeah. Nice. How the oh. hell? Oh. <laughs> there was the one square <laughs> or hexagon hole there. Nice. <laughs> Don't. <Dog. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's some more shit. <laughs> <laughs> They'll just see where you only see the finest of bullshit. <laughs> Organic, homegrown, free range bullshit. <laughs> God, Sorry no, again, no, Foxy. Sorry again, no, no preservatives. <laughs> no, no GMOs. Hormone Actually, it's free. a, it's a hundred percent genetically modified. It's genetically modified to fail. <laughs> Just bounce Damn it. that Straight hole, to please, him. please. No. Give me something to be happy about. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. yes. Ow. Yeah. No, we're kind of screwed for. Uh, the round. Did I help? You know what? It, 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 anything's no, possible, Someone touched man. it. It was Ben. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's so good. He scored on his own team. Dude, I'm crazy about getting goals right now, man. Go with myself. Woo. What the fuck was whoa, that? Whoa, Nobody whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Sorry, Scott. Oh, please, someone hit that. Oh. Oh, thank God for that. That was listening to I am deep. Yeah. Aww. That's a big fuck off hole. Nah, it's good. It's good. Don't worry about it. Just, just keep your eyes closed. Yeah, close the line. Lie back and think of England. <laughs> Give me one more. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Look at that frickin' pineapple. <laughs> pineapple of mockery. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Yay, my cocaine Voltron. <laughs> I guess somehow I touched the ball more times I, than I, be, I beat Scott. Yep. So. Ven came in second. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> it's okay. <sighs> You'll figure out how to make your controller work next week, big man. You need more chalk. You Aww. need to you need to go buy N brand liquid chalk. We need our own chalk. <laughs> that's all I'm hearing. 
<laughs> LGC Gamer Chalk. Yeah. <laughs> Gamer well, chalk. Oh, no, no, no. It's going to be LGC Linux Game Chalk. <laughs> there we chalk go. Chalk this went up to market. Yeah. <laughs> Do it. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and goils, um, we're going to piece Goyles? the fuck up out of here. <laughs> boils and ghouls. Goyles. It's been fun, man. <laughs> It's been real. Mm -hmm. Thanks for everybody showing up. Hi. Bye bye. And um <laughs> bye. <laughs> Aww, we love we'll you. be back next week if you want to participate in this madness. That time again is 8 30 Eastern Standard Moon Time, 7 30 if you're in a Discord. Uh for the patrons, uh it's when the pre pre super chosen kicks in and we'll be around. It'll be awesome. Aw, uh, not a duck, it's okay. Yeah, not a duck. Quack, quack. <laughs> just, just close your eyes <laughs> and make sure you know. <laughs> All right. That's good. Shut, shut your beak. Chaka Khan. <laughs> Die in a fire, everyone. Pedro, what are you playing to say? Uh, I'm guessing more, more, more Owens. More Owens. Oh, okay. thank you, Exalty. <laughs> yes. All right. Leave the Algonians alone. Cheers. Murdering mud crabs. Bye. Bye. We'll stick around on Discord if you're listening. Bye. You want to hop in.